I want to see something. Uh, I want to show you guys something. I want to show you guys something. Okay. I think I've shown you guys this actually before. Here, I'm going to scoot over so I can put a browser on the... Oh, she updated her website. Oh, this is pretty. Okay. I love this artist. I think they're so good. Uh, let's see. Okay. That's not what I'm looking for. One second. Are, are we down again? Oh, man. Why does this keep happening? Please. Uh, are we back? Are we back? We were down? Okay. Okay. Jeez. I don't know why it keeps disconnecting today. That's the third time. Uh, oh, let me make sure that the throw program is still active because sometimes... Okay, it's not. Good thing I checked. Not that you guys are not getting scammed if you ever throw things. Okay, okay. I want to ask you guys something. I want to ask you guys something. So, I considered this for a second, right? Considered this. Uh, also, hello, Mel! It's so good to see you! Big storm lover here, too. It was raining all day yesterday, and it felt lovely. Oh, I'm so jealous! That sounds so nice! Also, hi, Reaper! It's good to see you! Welcome in! Oh, we had a storm for just, like, 30 minutes. Just this little tiny cloud burst. It was so nice, but it didn't last very long. Okay, okay. Look. Look at, look at, look at. Okay. So, there's this model, right? I've been kind of tempted to get one. I want to know what you guys think. So, if I were to ever upgrade two point, uh, Blob to a 2.0, right? Uh, not saying I am, but like, if I ever did, right? Look at, look at this little fella. Look at this little fella. And then like, here. Uh, oh wait, that's not actually what I want. I just want to show you guys like the body. But, looky, look at that. You know, like how it has, oh, actually, um, can I pause it on that? Uh, look at that. Okay, so if I were to ever make a 2.0 blob, uh, would you guys like something that kind of looks like that? <laughs> I kind of like the head. I think it's so poofy and cute. Uh, not saying I am or anything, but just because I saw this model online and I, oh, this model makes my heart melt. You're not too big on that, even for current blob. That's fair, that's fair. That's precious, isn't it, twin? I love it. It's so cute. Is that the storm that killed you last stream? I don't know if the storm killed me. Or if it was, a, uh, like, some kind of construction thing? I don't know. They never said. Uh, but it was really weird. I think it was a construction thing. I really don't know. No, Blob is eternal. <laughs> okay, so you, got, you guys don't like this? Okay. That is good to know. It's really cute, though. Look at it. I mean, I could do both, you know? Get this silly little model and then also get... I mean, not uh, not really upgrading Blob. Blob is staying, I think, but I was looking at that because that's actually like a pay to use model. So you can buy that model and use it and like customize it and stuff, like change the colors. It's actually, it's, it's exactly like Blob. It's just, you know, like a little animal instead of like a Blob. <laughs> uh, but it's really cute. Uh, oh, OBS is... Uh, not... Mm. Are we live right now? OBS is being very weird. Uh, this is strange. Okay. Uh... Here, I'm taking another screenshot thing. Uh... I have like a little mod chat that I, <laughs> my mods probably get so annoyed at like getting all the dings in the mod chat. It's just because, it's just because I, uh, I put my screenshots there whenever something goes wrong and OBS is not very happy today. Uh, that's interesting. I don't know why it's being so fussy. That's weird. Hmm. 
Blob 2.0 should be Blob with the booba. <laughs> we are not giving Blob booba. That'd be so weird. No. <laughs> oh man. Could you imagine if it was like a blob like holding up just watermelons or something? <laughs> that would be amazing. It's not VTubing without the scuff. Dude, it is so true. OBS is uh, super freaking broken right now, but you know what? Uh, it doesn't matter as long as it's working. And it seems to be at least working, so that's something, I guess. It's just a... Uh, a little weird. Just a little weird, you know? Just a little weird. Yeah. Oh, there it is. We're back. Okay. Yeah, I don't know why OBS is uh, giving me issues today. Maybe it's because it didn't shut down properly yesterday. That could probably be it. Uh, Twitch itself exploded, so I guess it wasn't you? Oh, really? Oh, okay, okay. Well, good to know it's not me, I guess. Still stinks, but mm, okay. Are we live? I mean, am I alive? I don't know, Jay, am I alive? I don't know! Ugh. Panic. Time to run around and scream. Run in circles! Ah! Blob with a bikini and balloons, different colors. <laughs> yes! That'd be so funny. Oi. So holy crap, we're getting hail for the first time in your life and it's in August? Holy crap! Why? What the heck? <laughs> Nature is breaking. Armageddon is here. Run for the hills. It won't save you, but it might give you some time. <laughs> what the heck, nature? You got a cake first? Oh, you got a fake first, by the way, earlier. Feel free to take it away. A fake? Oh, the first thing. Oh. Ah, <laughs> uh, thank you for... <laughs> okay, okay. Oh, man. Oh. Uh there we go. <laughs> Sorry about that. I don't know why. Here, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna turn off the first redeem just in case that happens again. Here we go. First, turn off. Thank you for letting me know. Thank you. Thank you. Is this a dream or not, dude? Just, I. I don't know at this point. We are all living in the matrix. I'm awake and I'm alive. Mm hmm. Oh man, let's see. We are about an hour into stream. If we want, we could hop into Elden Ring. I think. Possibly. Yes, yes. I don't know if, yeah, we could pop into Elden Ring. I'm like nervous that it's just gonna crash everything. But I think we'll be fine, we'll be fine. Uh. Your window is getting absolutely battered. Part of you wants to go outside and see how much it would hurt. You should. Go do it. Do it. Do it. I think, listen, if you've never had hell before, you should experience it. Run outside. See what it, see what it's like. I like hail a lot. I mean, it's dangerous, of course, when it gets to be really, really, really big hail. But I think people, like, talk about big hail too much because big hail doesn't usually happen. Usually it's, like, teeny tiny little skittle-sized hail, right? So you should, you should, you should run outside, see what it's like. Do it, do it, do it. Listen, if it's golf ball sized tail, maybe don't. But that stuff is super rare, you know? Honestly, you're fine with just chatting. That's fair, that's fair. Oof. Here, let me put up a poll. What would you guys rather do? What do? Chatting. Elden Ring. There we go. Yeah. I'm good either way. I am just happy to be here. Yesterday, Scar did about, what, two and a half hours of just chatting? Yeah. <laughs> I think it was exactly two and a half hours, actually. Oh, that actually reminds me. Yesterday, I was gonna mention this, but I forgot. Uh, dude! Okay, so you guys know I have, like, a lot of, a lot of sleep issues, right? Lots and lots of sleep issues. So many sleep issues. It's kind of terrible. I've been to the sleep doctor about it. They didn't really do anything. I've tried different medications. They don't really do much. Uh, it's stinky. So, I got these sleep gummies, right? 
They are um, special sleep gummies. You know? The, the, the special kind. Mm -hmm. The special kind of sleep gummies. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Give it on the crashing. Elden Ring doesn't sound safe. That's fair. That's fair. Honestly, I'm good, I'm good either way. We could also do just chatting for a little while longer and then, you know, in another hour or so do Elden Ring. I'm good with whatever. Skyrim got that gummy kush. The good good. Mm -hmm. I got them good good gummies. Mm -hmm. Did you find if half a gummy worked? Yeah, so I cut it in half uh, because everybody was telling me if it's your first time, only take a half, you know? So I cut it in half. Uh, I was asking my sister about it the next day because I was like, dude, sister, sister Faye, I got so dizzy and lightheaded and not, not necessarily in a bad way, but like, dude, every once in a while the world was reeling and I got so confused so confused holy moly i could not keep a thought in my brain for very long at all it was like the thoughts would just get wiped out of my brain i was like is that normal is that is that is that how, is that how you're supposed to feel and she's like no <laughs> i mean you can but if that's how you're feeling you should probably be taking a fourth of the gummies <laughs> so uh yeah um <laughs> it worked it worked great uh, but, uh, yeah, um, you guys tied the pole? <laughs> you guys tied it! <sighs> you guys, you, you mushies. You tried clicking Elden Ring at the last second. Oh, that's fair. We can move over to Elden Ring. We can chat for, like, a, just a little bit while longer and then move over to Elden Ring if you guys want. Why not just chatting in Elden Ring? We could do both, yeah. I mean, we're gonna be exploring for a lot of the stream anyway, because I need at least one more Shadow Tree Fragment before I try to do the Putrescent Night again. So it is gonna be, it is gonna be a good decent amount of just chatting. But Scary called her family and was like, what if we had a gun that shoots like mini sandwiches? <laughs> I remember, okay, so I went to bed before Untyped did. Oh, so hello, Dees. It's good to see you. Beautiful model. I love your voice. That's so sweet of you. Thank you. I appreciate that. It's good to have you here. I love the Eden emotes. Oh, and the Diariku emotes. Oh my gosh, I love Diariku. She is such a talented artist. Holy crap. It's good to have you here, though. Welcome in. That sounds like you on gummies? Really? Scar entered free word mode. Dude. I, I, oh, yeah. I apparently half a gummy was too much. <laughs> and so I took, it was either like a third or a fourth of a gummy last night. And it kind of worked. I think it worked. Yeah, it worked. But, uh, you got no tolerance. Apparently I don't either. <laughs> yeah, I remember untyped coming in after I had taken the half of a gummy. And I was so out of it. <laughs> Half a gummy and Scary was tasting colors. It was awful. <laughs> oh, it was awful. I, uh, I remember Untyped coming in and he started talking to me. I don't remember what he was talking about or I started talking to him. I, I don't know. It was, uh, it was so weird though. I just remember he said something and I just, I, I said something back and then I stared at him and I was like, what did I, what did I say? What's going on? What's happening? <laughs> I was so confused. I didn't remember anything. It was horrible. If half a gummy is too much, an entire one might kill you. Not literally. Dude, I, I, dude, I'm not gonna lie. If, if they weren't so expensive, I think it was like 10, $15 for a pack of four. If it weren't that expensive, I would be so tempted to take a full one. <laughs> Just to see what would happen, you know? Like, what, 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 it wouldn't. Well, actually, I would probably have to look it up and see if that's bad before doing it. But, uh, <laughs> I would be very, very tempted, tempted to see, just to see what it was like, you know? But, uh, yeah, I, I was, I was, uh, I was out of it. <laughs> Untyped came home and Scary had installed beaded curtains and a Jamaican flag. Nah, dude, I was like, 
I was so dizzy. I was just laying in bed, like, the world was spinning. It was so weird. Oh, it was awful. It was terrible. I did go to sleep, though. I was able to fall asleep, even though I was really freaking stressed that day. And usually when, I, when I'm stressed, I just have an even harder time falling asleep, you know? So, it, it worked. Did what it was supposed to. I took it last night as well, and it kind of helped. Uh, I ended up, like, I fell asleep, which is the hardest part, but then I woke up at 2.30 a.m., and it took me over two hours to fall back asleep because I think the gummy had worn off, and I didn't want to use it again because I, again, those are expensive, and so I kind of just laid there for several hours. <laughs> That's kind of awful. So, uh, uh, yeah, Chris, you became limp like spaghetti and rolled around on the floor. <laughs> Oh boy. Yeah, that sounds like fun. Uh, I kind of want to try it, but they're just so expensive, you know? The next day Untyped has to tweet and make a Discord announcement that Scar is in the hospital. No! No! Oh. I, I don't feel like... Oh. Uh, I don't feel like that would send you to the hospital, right? As far as I know, like, the, the, the good, good stuff, the kush, the kush, kush... It, like, doesn't... It's not that bad for you. Like, it doesn't send you to the hospital, right? I don't think it does anyway. It would be really funny, though, if Untyped had to make a tweet being like, Sorry, Skari is tweaked out of her mind and probably shouldn't be streaming. <laughs> that would be awful. But nah, I'm just using it to... I'm just using it to get to sleep at this point. I'm not really super interested in using it during the day. I just, uh... I just want to be able to sleep, man. <laughs> it's the only thing that allows me to sleep anymore. Stay hydrated and indoors, because apparently there's some outside named something outside named heat, and they're stroking people. Oh gosh, mobs, <laughs> that's terrible, dude. You're so right, though. Uh, actually, my phone gives me uh, warnings whenever there's really, really bad weather. And for the past week, I think, like the whole heckin' week, uh. We've had heat advisory warnings because it's so hot outside. So that's fun. That's fun. Uh, you think you would need so much in your system for that to happen? Not, not realistic, unless it's just like super concentrated amounts of it. Mm. Mm -hmm. Anything can send you to the hospital if it's too much. I mean, that's true, but it's kind of like how much you take, right? Yeah. Scar, you guys. Scar, you can't stream today. She's licking the lamp because she ate a whole special gummy. That'd be terrible. <laughs> Elevated Scarry Stream win. Dude. <laughs> Honestly, I would be down at some point. The only thing that is keeping me from doing it is I worry that I would say something stupid, you know? Like either I would dox myself or I would, uh, you know, give details on stuff that I'm trying to keep secret, like the 2.0 or something. I don't want that to happen. I don't want to spill any secrets. Yeah, don't do that. Yeah. So I, 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 uh, as funny as it would be, and I do think it would be very funny, I worry a little bit too much. <laughs> I don't think, I don't think I would, uh, I don't think I'd trust myself. Might be entertaining, but not worth it. Have untyped as a minder. I could, I could. You're still baffled that it was over 90 degrees today and now we have ice from the sky? That is weird, Jay. That is really weird. Hi, Nero. It's good to see you. Welcome in, welcome in. If Skari got hella zooted from a gummy, you would want Untapped to take pictures and crudely draw Skari over IRL Skari. <laughs> that would be so funny. <laughs> yeah! Oh, man. Dude, I might have to find somebody on VGen who could draw, like, a really zooted Skari. Just, like, Skari just splayed out on the ground, just like, Ugh, I see color. I taste colors. I smell... I, I, I smell sounds. <laughs> it would have to be pre-recorded and heavily doctored. Yeah, I don't really want to give away all the secrets, you know? <laughs> Dude, there are some things that I've been wanting to talk to you guys about that have been so hard to not say, you know? I don't know if I trust Zooted Skari. Skari's gonna be like drinking out of the cups guy. The drinking out of the cups guy? 
Dude, dude, I need to stop living under a rock. I don't think I know who that is. Oof. It would be rough, though. Mm-hmm. Like, imagine if Scary's just leaning off the couch, upside down, so Untyke takes a pick and draws Scary over Scary. <laughs> for real? Ugh. Zooted Scary would probably not be able to do that for very long, though, because regular Scary, uh, has a very bad time if she does that. <laughs> oh, dude. I cannot have my head lower than my body like that for very long. It's a bad time. Zooted Scary would reveal 2.0 details. She really would. She really would. It would be awful. Really bad. <laughs> You know somebody who might draw that? That would be a lot of fun. <laughs> maybe one day, maybe one day. Ugh. It's a very old video where a guy took acid in a closet and they recorded his ramblings. <laughs> oh no! Oh boy. Well, I'm glad he had friends around to keep him safe. Imagine if it got so bad that Scary saw her cat cleaning itself and thought, Let me clean you and proceeded to lick the cat. Oh, please, no! They're so dirty! Dirty kitties! Hi, Yumi! Yeah, you're dirty! I don't know if you guys could hear her, but she agrees with you all. That would be gross. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna take a drink real quick. One minute. Had to shake my cup first, because... Make sure you shake your gamer subs, otherwise it all... All the powder goes to the bottom. Meow. <laughs> <laughs> meow, meow. Uh, Scary half shouldn't be that bad. Scary but zooted. My hand is rainbow and the clouds are cats. <laughs> Dude, for real. I thought half would be safe. Apparently half was not safe. Not safe at all. Ugh. Well... Okay, it wasn't the worst thing. Half wasn't terrible, but I definitely got really dizzy. Not in a bad way either, just it was a really weird, really weird feeling. Very dizzy, very, uh, like, uh, very dizzy, very, uh, I don't want to say lightheaded, because lightheaded makes it sound bad. I mean, it was kind of stinky, but... Not as bad as, like, my usual lightheaded dizziness. That, that feels awful. Ugh. You imagine Zooted Scary streaming? Somebody says something even vaguely reminding her of the 2.0 and she starts spilling the beans like, Yeah, the sky was super blue! And then Zooted Scary says, Speaking of blue, 2.0 has- Yeah. <laughs> For real! Speaking of 2.0, uh, it actually looks like this, and it has this and this and this, and I can't do freckles because this and this and this and this, and you know how it says it has the night sky color palette? Well, do you want to see how it has the night sky color palette? Look, maybe I can show you a picture. I have so many pictures of 2.0 Ascari, which I actually do have a few pictures of 2.0 Ascari. I'm not going to show you guys them, obviously. You guys are going to see them when, you know, it comes out, but I currently have three pictures like, three art pieces done of 2.0 Scary. I have two more on the way? Two more? No, three more on the way. Three more on the way. Uh, and, you know, all the emotes and everything, so. I have a lot of stuff I would accidentally reveal to you guys, and I don't want that. I would prefer you guys to see it, you know, when we get to the reveal. Uh. Why is it the same as yesterday? Dude, 100% stinky. That is insane. Hi, good luck. It's good to see you. I'm so sorry you're that stinky. Uh, maybe stay on the other side of the chat, you know? <laughs> for, for no reason at all. You know, no reason, no reason. <laughs> Zooted Scary would be Scary's worst enemy in terms of secrets. It's true. You know what's funny, though? I feel like Zooted Scary would still call Scary Scary because at this point in my life, I have been streaming for so long that calling myself my IRL name, my true name, as it were, you know, the fey name that none shall reveal, uh, calling myself that name is actually kind of weird now. <laughs> Which, maybe that means that I need to go outside more and touch grass more, uh, so that I can hear other people call me that name, but, yeah, uh... No, Groovy, you're not supposed to- Gro Groovy, you're not supposed to dox me like that, how dare you? <laughs> Her real name is Gregory, how could you? <laughs> Scary has to go on a training arc and she'll come back to us talking about Aqua Tween Hunger Force and Tim and Eric show. 
It'll be insane. It'll just, it'll be a wild time. 2.0 Scar is no longer Faye, but a mushroom. How did you know? Neuro, who told you? <laughs> Who's revealing my secrets? Why are you guys, why are you guys just dishing out all the secrets today? What is this? <laughs> You feel the same? You're a massive introvert and you rarely ever hear your, hear your real name? Yeah, Griff, yeah. It's very weird. I'll, listen, I admit, when, before I started streaming, I was not very internet safe. And I used my IRL name everywhere. Online. Everywhere. It was my username for a lot of sites. Uh, it was, you know... I, I, I wouldn't usually make my characters named after myself. I don't think I ever really did that, but it was very frequently like my username or if I joined a Final Fantasy FC, um, I would introduce myself like, you know, my Final Fantasies, my Final Fantasy character's name is IL. So, you know, people would call me IL, but I also have a bunch of alts. And so if they ever got to know me like on Discord or anything, I'd be like, oh, just call me my IRL name, you know? You can call me IL if you want, but just call me my IRL name because I have a bunch of alts as well, you know? So it's not terribly uh, internet safe, um, thinking back on that. Uh, but yeah, uh, I don't really do that as much anymore, you know? Nowadays when I meet people, I'm just like, yeah, call me Skari. I'm kind of like slowly moving away from using my IRL name everywhere, which is probably uh, safer. You know, Scarry's real name is Toweri, 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 That's a weird name, Tramp. No! Negative two. Bad. Get bonked. <laughs> when you think about it, it's funny how living things can just get conditioned into things. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That Pavlov effect is strong, you know? Usernames aside, how did you make such a cute blob? Dude, this blob model is actually adorable. Here, let me... Here, do you guys want to see, like, all the different options you can do with Blob? Be if you guys are ever thinking of trying out VTubing, first of all, very highly recommend using a PNG, but if you want to do VTubing in particular, I don't think a lot of people know this, but there's actually a lot of pre-made models you can get for, like, 20 bucks, and they are insanely customizable. So, like, this Blob, 20 bucks, but... You can also get like actual people models as well. So if you want to try VTubing VTubing, you can get like a pre-made human model. And a lot of the times they'll have things like elf ears, dragon horns. They have like a lot of customizability options, you know? And so it's a really good way to try VTubing and like have an actual VTuber model. Yeah, you can't be like super duper customized. Like most of them don't have antlers. But, you know, that's kind of what a 2.0 would be for, you know? So, they're really good if you just want to try them out. Bad egg. Yeah. Look, here. Uh, can I remember how to do this? Let's see. How do I remember? Let's see. I think it's this. Create new expression. Look at this. Look at this. Okay, this is blob, right? Blob. Blob. So this particular blob, there is a blob pack that the seller makes that has all the options. This blob does not have all the options. This blob has cow, sheep, bunny, mouse, deer, horse, and pig options. So like, I can have a pig tail. I can have a horse tail. Uh, deer tail. Look how cute the deer tail is, by the way. I love this deer tail so much. It is so cute. Ugh. Look how cute that is! Isn't it adorable? Ugh. Jay, you use pseudonyms everywhere except Discord, so your parents would always be confused when you got packages for Gordon Freeman or for Dick Kickum. Dick Kickum! Oh my gosh! <laughs> I love that! Oh, yeah, I need to use pseudonyms more often. I, I've started to. Look, mouse tail. Cute little mouse tail. Sheep tail, or they also call it a bunny tail. Sheep tail, bunny tail. And then I use the cow tail because Skari has a... Skari has a long tail. I was gonna give Skari a deer tail when I made her because she's a deer, right? But, uh, 
I wanted you guys to actually be able to see my tail. And if I had a deer tail, you guys would never see it except for in like fan art or whatever or commissioned art. And that stinks. I want a tail. I want a tail toggle. I want a tail that you guys can see. You know, there's the deer ears. Uh Yeah, you know. Oh, these are I guess the cow slash sheep ears. Like there's a whole lot of options. Mouse ears. Look at the mouse ears. Aren't these cute? These are so adorable. But yeah, you can make like Dude, you can do so many things with Blob. You can give him spots. See? Like, you can do so many things with it. And there are so many customizable models like this. It's insane. It's so cute. I can be a unicorn. Look at that! Look at the little horn! It's so cute! I can have, like, actual horns. Uh, I can have, you know, my antlers, of course. But I can make the antlers, like, really small or big. Like, models like these are amazing. If you want to start out VTubing, I can get rid of Blob's legs. So it's just a Blob. No leggies. You know? But I like the leggies. Uh, there's this hairstyle. Blob actually has access to another hairstyle. Look how cute this one is! Look at the little mohawk! I love it! It's so cute! Uh, and yeah, that's, you know... Little dots, you can do, like, more little dots. Lots of little dots, you know? Like, I can even do a pig nose if I want. Look at that! Look how cute it is! It's so cute! I can, like, move my mouth down if I want you guys to still be able to see my mouth with the pig nose. Blob is so customizable, it's insane! If you want to start VTubing, start by robbing a bank. You joke, but, uh, <laughs> VTubing is very expensive, yeah. Okay, there we go. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Back to regular blob. But yeah, lots of options. Lots of options. Yeah, VTubing is very expensive, but there are things you can do to make it less expensive, like those pre-made models that I was just talking to you guys about. Piggy blob, yeah, piggy blob. Etsy is also another really good place to go for, like, overlays and stuff. You do got to be a little careful because AI art is running rampant on Etsy, so you want to make sure you're not getting, like, AI backgrounds or AI, you know, models. Cough, cough. Ow. <laughs> but, like, all my sub badges, all my channel point badges, my bit badges, uh, this overlay, the little, like, daily thing right here, little daily moon, you know, thing. Uh, almost everything I use, even my chat box, this little chat box thing, like with the stars and everything, it's so pretty, right? All that comes from Etsy. And you know, it was all pretty cheap, like 10 bucks maybe. So, well, I think the overlay was a little bit more expensive, but this overlay is like super nice. This overlay is amazing. But yeah, anyway, that's my advice. If anybody is, uh, you know, wanting to try out VTubing. But yeah, but yeah, Bob can go super fan. <laughs> For real. I love that little hair, like the little sticky up hair. I think it's so funny looking. It's so cute. I like how you used your ear to point at the moon. <laughs> it makes a good pointer, you know? Oops, I grabbed the mushroom instead of me. Oops. Yeah, it makes a good pointer. <laughs> it's fantastic, see? Look at that, look at that. <laughs> Listen, I don't have a hand that can point, so I gotta, I gotta be creative, all right? I could use my antler. This thing. <laughs> oh, but yeah. The only AI you want is Alfredo. Yeah. Alfredo, that's incredible. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Or awesome iguanas. Mm -hmm. Yup, yup. I can't actually think of a food that starts with I. Awesome ice cream. There we go. Awesome ice cream. <laughs> we need a scary cursor for PCs that's just a floppy little ear. <laughs> that would be so cute! Uh, oh, I'd love that. Bad. Mm-hmm. 
All right. Actually, do we want to pop into Elden Ring? It looks like things are a little bit more stable. Now that I say that, though, I'm a little worried that it's going to be like, oh, you think I'm stable? <laughs> the bug crashes. <laughs> the only AI you want is Kizuna AI. Yeah, Kizuma AI. There's a bunch of artists as well. Okay, it... <laughs> It always makes me feel so awkward when there are artists out there who use AI as like a last name or whatever. I know it's an actual name, but I always see that and I get like a little, oh, um, <laughs> uh, one of my favorite artists has AI as like as her last name and I, I always stare at it. I'm like, oh, you, you, you're not using AI, right? No, it's just, it's just the name. It's just the name. It's just the name. <laughs> it's so unfortunate. It really is. It's awful. I really want to commission them, but I'm waiting until 2.0 has been revealed or until 2.0 is closer to being debuted because I really want them to be able to just post it immediately, you know, on their socials because they deserve more love. They deserve all the love. And so I want them to be able to like, share the artwork and stuff, you know? I want to be able to bring people over to them. Which, I guess I could just, you know, share it after 2.0 gets released, but I don't know. You know, I always feel bad asking artists to be like, hey, hey, I'm sorry, my community doesn't know what the 2.0 looks like yet. They're not gonna find out until October. Could you just, like, hold on to this until October? I always feel so bad asking that, you know? So, eh. Yeah. I've also just bought a lot of artwork recently and I really need to heck and slow down, but mm, that's fine. Goodbye, everyone. Be safe and healthy. Thank you for streaming. Thanks for being here, Sarah. Also, hi, Sunny. Hello. Thank you for blob. Oh, I keep hitting the wrong buttons. Oy, oy. You've always said that you would want to be a goblin VTuber if you streamed, but you could test the waters with a frog. You should. Yeah, do it, do it. You should buy the little frog model just on the off chance that you ever try to stream someday. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The frog is fantastic. It is so heckin' cute. I maybe let them make a sneak peek for 2.0. That's actually a pretty good idea, Lost. That is pretty good. I have been like trying to figure out how I want to advertise 2.0 when it starts getting around the to be uh, like around that point, because you know I don't want to give away the whole thing, but I definitely want to get like teasers and stuff so that people will see that and be like, "Wow, I should go check that out." You know? Hi, undercover. It's good to see you. The devil went to Jamaica. He was looking to sell some weed. He was doing fine. He was there, standing in line. It was excellent weed indeed. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. I hope you're having a good day, though, Undercover. Oh, my God! Listen, I don't got it. I don't got the Kush Kush. I mean, that you know of. Listen, it's mine, okay? You can't have it. You can't have it. It's mine. I use it for sleeping. <laughs> Thank you for the bits, though. That's sweet of you. Oh. Ah, crap. I'm sorry, Elden Ring. Elden Ring is yelling at me because my power went out. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right. <laughs> Scary quick question before you go. When you're at an appropriate point in the Elden Ring DLC, can you tell the lore of what happened at the beginning of the story? Yeah, as long as, yeah, as long as it's not a spoiler or anything, I'm totally fine with that, yeah. Sunny, stop! Wait, no, undercover, wait, undercover, why are you bonking? <laughs> uh, no bonking, that's so rude! I'm gonna bonk you back, just you wait, one of these days. <laughs> You could do the silhouette thing where they make a mini video of the VTuber model being all black and they show bits of it while moving. I'm definitely going to try to do something like that. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I know how to do it while it's moving, but it's just something I'm going to have to figure out, right? There is going to be a lot of spoiler, or not spoilers, a lot of teasers. I think I'm also going to do a teaser of like just the eyes. So you guys will see what the eyes look like. Like, have you guys ever seen... I, you guys have probably seen it before. I think it's a fairly common teaser to, like, just show the eyes, but, like, the rest of the model is dark or something. I always thought that was really, really pretty. So I'm definitely gonna do that. Uh, and that'll be, like, probably, like, a day or so before the, you know, before the stream. You guys are gonna see, like, more and more with that probably being, like, the biggest thing that you see. Otherwise, it's probably just gonna be dark. 
Can I see your map so you know where you've been to? Yeah. Here we go. I hope this is okay. Uh, I know it's like pretty zoomed out, but Hi. what if you made a silhouette of the Scary 2.0 model, but when you unveil the teaser, it's just a weird shaped blob. <laughs> Wait, wait, okay, I'm taking a screenshot of that griff, because that's genius. Okay, okay. <laughs> I I am saving that, I am saving that, okay. Uh, where should I save that? I'll save that in my... Uh, where should I save that? I'll just save that, you know what, I'll just save that, like, right here, and then I can move it later if I need to. There we go. There we go. All right. <laughs> That's an amazing idea, Griff. I love that. Oi. Spawning in and getting, imme uh, getting items immediately. Yeah, it's because we, uh, it's because we crashed last time. So it's, uh, you know. I'm a little surprised that there is no bonfire on this island. I was kind of expecting there to be one, you know? You guys are peaceful? That's nice. Um, yeah, no bonfire here. Thank you for the stretch! Ugh, we should get a Breath of the Wild moment where the mushies run up a hill and see the new scurry in the distance with piano music and everything. Dude, that would be so nice. Oh, I would love that. If I can afford an animation, I would love to do something like that, but those things are kind of expensive. But that would be really pretty. Uh, we, uh, I can tell you the lore now? Oh, then sure, yeah, go ahead. Go ahead, I'd love to hear it. Makes sense, there aren't bonfires. Oh, <laughs> well, heck you, Groovy. Fine, okay, I'm surprised there's not grass. <laughs> it's fun, it's fun. Okay, crab, really? Man, these lobsters, crabs, and junk just choose violence immediately. It's so rude. I did nothing to you. I was just running on by. Uh, keep in mind, she hasn't found a mesmer yet, so if it includes mesmer. Oh, yeah, I have not found a mesmer. I know where mesmer is. I know mesmer's in here, but I've never. I haven't met mesmer yet. I haven't been able to find him. It's awful. That place is so big, and I feel like I've explored every inch of it, but apparently not. Can't find mesmer. Don't know where he is. Alright, there's a giant lobster on the ceiling, so we just go around like this. Stay away from the lobster. Um, it looked like there was something over here as well, but... Nope, never mind. Okay. Uh... Oh! Joya! <laughs> Dude! I'm the biggest baby ever! I looked over, I saw the chat getting flooded, and it spooked the crap out of me. Welcome! Choya, it's so good to see you guys. Hello. My name is Skari. For those who don't know me, I'm a fave YouTuber that plays a bunch of indie Nintendo and sounds like games. How was your stream? You guys are playing Portal, right? You are doing Portal with Cam, right? How did that go? It's so good to see you all. You are a baby. Listen, listen. Just because I get easily spooked. <laughs> I really in RR right now untyped. Hi, Silent. Hi, Unicorn. Hello, me. Hi, G Hi, Gigi. It's good to see you all. Welcome in. Willow, thank you for the follow. All right, all right. Doing the Ara Ara. Ahem, for you, Raiders. Ah! There you go. There you go. Really? You guys, are, you guys are the absolute worst. Why would you do a little time right when the Raiders get here? You guys are the worst. Ow! No! Oh my gosh, exploding gummy worms. Why are they exploding? Holy crap. The best hour hours. Thank you! They're freaking fantastic! The best hour hours on Twitch. I promise nobody has better hour hours than I do. Ooh! No! No! Ah! Stop exploding. Stop it. Stop it. Also, I apologize, waiters. Uh. Ah! <laughs> Why is it looking at me? Don't look at me! Why does it move like that? Did you guys say that? That was disgusting! That was awful! Hi, K Kats Katsua! Hello, Katsua! I'm sorry, I stumbled over your name really bad there. It's good to see you! I hope you're up to- ah! I just wanted the item! Oh, this 
the gummy worms there. But why did it move like that? Did you see that, like, jerky way that it moved? That was terrifying. You're gonna be mean. They're the worst RRs. They're so good. What are you talking about? They're the best RRs. You're just jealous. But anyways, I hope you guys had a good stream. Thank you so much for stopping by. If you guys have to get food or water or any of that kind of stuff, definitely do so. Definitely stand up. Stretch. Take a nap if you need to. I appreciate you guys being here. It's so fun to have you all. Those are like the hollow neck jellyfishes. Dude, they kind of are. Dude, when it looked over at me, that terrified me. Ah! Ah! Oh! Why is its face like that? Why does it move so fast? I could just call you Haru. Sounds good. Hello, Haru. Hello, hello. Oh, man. She's so scared. Dude, why did it move like that? It's so fast. It just numed. No, not ghost doggies. I hate them. Man, this place sucks. Stop being alive. Oh, you're not a dog. You're a person. I, I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. Okay. Okay. Well. Mm -hmm. I can call you Sky if you want, because everyone else does. Oh, sounds good, sounds good. Yeah, hello, Sky. Hello, Zai. Gummy worms, one hug. I don't want a hug, though. Oh, please be a shadow tree fragment. Not a shadow tree fragment. Okay, well, that's kind of rude, actually. I just really wanted a shadow tree fragment. The gummy worms remind you of Coco from Animal Crossing? Oh, they kind of do look like Coco. Dude, I hate those faces. It's awful. We just need one more shadow tree fragment. Just one more. But I don't know where any are. Oh. Man. Uh. Yeah, I don't know where they are. Why am I, why is my, why am I, why are my runes right now? I don't remember dying over there. Uh, the gummy worms remind you of Coco. Oh wait, I already read that. Oh, was that a spoiler? Oh, she's not been that far. Oh. Oh. Yeah, no worries. Thank you for keeping an eye out, Obochi. Yeah, I'm sorry. I I am not as far as I probably should be. I've done a lot of exploring, but I haven't actually been able to find a ton of bosses yet. So I apologize. You thought she was? Yeah, no worries. No worries. Unfortunately, I haven't actually gotten all that far. I haven't found Mesmer. Um... Yeah, sadly not. I'm sorry. I, I wish I was farther, but... I am very far behind. Very far behind indeed. I've found a lot of places, but that's kind of it. Kind of it. Alright, is it is the Uwu time over yet? No, we got one more minute. Ugh, I hate Uwu time. Why must we do Uwu time? Why the Uwus? Why? Why are my runes right here? Oh, this is where I jumped off to see if I could... To see if I could go over there. But I died to that boss. I thought. No, wait, did I not? I don't know why my runes are right here. Anyway, I guess it doesn't matter. Um, your model is so adorable. Thank you, Haru. Thank you, thank you. This is our blob model. Oh, okay, okay. Uwo time is over. I also apologize because for some reason I feel like Uwu time, my voice just kind of slips back into the regular voice at some times. I can't actually tell. It's very weird. Oh, you're going to head out? Sounds good, Sarah. Thank you so much for being here. I hope you're having an amazing day. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. I always love hanging out with you. I hope you have a good rest of your evening. Uh, how's my day been? It's been really good. We just spent about two hours chatting. About two hours. Uh, maybe like an hour and a half. Um, 
And now we're just looking for shadow tree fragments because... I, I'm at the, yeah, I'm at the putrescent night, and I'm getting my ass beat, so I really want, oh, oops. I really want to be able to, I really want to be able to do a little bit more damage, so I'm trying to find more shadow tree fragments so I don't die as fast, and so I don't take as much, uh, so I can do more damage and take less damage, I guess. But yeah... The oohs are for the people. <laughs> listen, listen, the oohs are fine. Oh, wait, oh! For some reason, my brain corrected that to Ara Aras. Listen, the Ara, the oohs are great. I just. <laughs> Five minutes feels so long! Wanna know what's adorable? Scarry falling. Wow! Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, you meant skibbity tree fragments? Yeah, mm hmm, yeah, sure, totally. Mm hmm. <laughs> and I'm free! We are skadoosh hunting. Hello, cat. Welcome in. We are skadoosh hunting. I am having the worst heckin' luck finding these fragments. I thought they were supposed to be, like, everywhere, but... Dude, I haven't been able to find any. Uh, I just need one more. I mean, preferably a lot more, but... I went over here. I thought, I thought for sure this island would have one. Uh, yeah, they, they, they're, they're just, they're avoiding me. It's really rude. What's adorable is this? Ah, curse you raiders! <laughs> I love that copy pasta so much. It's so good. It's so good. Uh, why are you guys falling? I have not fallen once this stream. Not even a single time. Not even once. You always feel bad when Scarry gets raided and you don't have enough points for Ara or the Uwu time. <laughs> you guys! Why do you embarrass me in front of the raiders? Why? <laughs> That's so mean. Not sure where you've picked them up or you'd try to point you in a way that you need it. There's only some that you're learning of now. Yeah, dude, they're... Oh. That's okay, that's okay. I... You know what? I'm gonna go try to fight this guy, because I remember we tried to fight him day one, and he was a little bit too tough. But I think... I think I could take him now. So I'm gonna try. Yeah, no worries. No worries. I was under the impression that they were easy to find. I am very quickly realizing that is not the case. Uh, they are quite a bit tougher than I was expecting. But that's okay. That's okay. We will... we'll find some. I'll be all right. Uh, the guts boss, dude. I love this guy. He was listen. He was too strong day one, but I think I got this now. I think I got this. I think we can do this. Heck yeah. Uh, <laughs> I love that little like laying down, like kind of dead looking emote lost. It's so cute. I love that it's in two parts. That's so good. All right, you. You're gonna do that. I'm gonna do this. Take this, Mr. Guts Bus. Deal with the bleed. Ha ha ha! I am faster than you now. How do you like that? Oh. Oh yeah, he doesn't do a whole lot of damage anymore. Ba -bow, ba -bow. Yeah, this is easy. Easy. Oh. I almost feel bad for him. Almost. He's a bit of a turd. Just a bit of a turd. Just a bit. Just a bit. Take the blade! Maybe. Oh! Oh, right. Oh. Meow! Scary why? Wait, Scary. Sunny! <laughs> what the heck? We have apparently just become the same person. Why are you meowing? Sunny confirmed cat? Question mark? Also, hi, Yasuke! It's good to see you! There we go. Okay. Sir, you need to stop. It's time to give it up! Ow! Ow, 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 ow! We have become the ultimate human. 
Dude, it's true. We have combined our powers into one. You suck, Mr. Knight! Let me attack! <laughs> ah! All right, all right. Sunny is scary. I, uh, you know what? I'm sorry you all had to find out this way, but yeah, we're actually just the same person. <laughs> Surprise! Uh, good to see you too. Feeling cute. Might bonk later. Wow. Wow. You know, the real cuties don't actually bonk. I'll have you know. It's a super secret secret. But yes. No bonking from the real cuties. Ugh. All right. I'm just stretching in my chair a little bit. You all should stretch as well. Who knows how long you've been sitting? You gotta take care of those little mushy bodies of yours. The real cuties bunk the unsay so ones. And what are you? Unsay so. I am not unsay so. I am so say so. I am say so because I say so. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's uh, Angel's 80. Angel's 80 splat. Splat 1 and 2, the artist streams if you want to check her out. They only say her name if you want her to. No worries, no worries. I could actually see her, uh, I could actually see her name just from clicking on the emote. But I love it. I think it's such a cute little idea. Dude, the little two-parter emotes like that are so fun. Kind of reminds me of, um, we have, like, the eyeball emotes. Like, the little face with the mouth <laughs> that are kind of a two-parter. I just think they're so fun to see, especially one like that. Cause usually, oh, thank you for the, thank you for the, lurk slot sky. Oh gosh, I just called you like every name under the sun. Thank you for the lurk. Uh, but yeah, usually I see like those kind of emotes, but they're just like one. It's kind of fun to see it in two pieces because then it gets bigger, you know. Oh, uh, ow! That was my bad. I probably could have dodged that a little better. All right, you know what? Fine, they're gonna be all the way over there. No, get bonked on. Don't bonk me. I want you to get bonked on. That's rude. Ow. Oh, jeez. Oh. Oh. Dude, I have the hardest time dodging that ability. Can you not, sir? Oh. Okay, we're both just gonna miss each other. It's gonna be really cute. All right. Ow. No, no. Stop that! There we go, get bled on. Get bleeded. Ow! Okay, okay. Ugh. Ah, oh, dang it. I hate that attacking the guy doesn't knock him out of his, uh, little windy ability. Gosh dang it, dude. Why did I feel like I was faster than him when I started, but now he's, like, way faster than I am? Dude, stop! Stop! But I suck at this game. Let this be a testament to any of you. If you guys think, oh, I suck at Souls Likes, I can't play Souls Likes, you will never suck as hard as I do. And yet... We persist. Here we go. There we go. Oh my gosh, dude. You're making me look bad in front of the mushies. Okay. You know what? No, heck you. Bow, bow, bow. Oh. Oh. All right, back up. Gosh dang it, I keep thinking that has more range than it actually does. Here, this should kill ya. There we go! All right, first try. That was the first try. First try, first try, first try. Mm -hmm. First try, first try. Christopher, those are amazing, let's go. Those are so cute. Oh my gosh, I love that little frog one. <gasps> I love that, that is so good. Great Sword of Solitude. Ooh. Oh, I actually really like that design. Helm of Solitude. Ooh. Dang. Okay, okay. Good stuff. Good stuff. Nice. Wait, why was I one-handing that? What the heck? All right. I think that gives us enough to level up. Oops. All right. 
Da wäre Do the mouth between the leggies emo. No. <lacht> uh, I love the leggies too. They're so good. You can make so many cursed things with them. You will never suck as hard as I do. Gosh dang it, Groovy! <laughs> I swear. You guys are finding the absolute worst freaking quotes. You will never suck as hard as I do. There we go. That was quote number 66. Holy moly. Uh, it completely reminds you of the boss it came from. Oh. Uh. Oh, the special attack of the halberd. I need to start reading things in order. Ugh. It really does. It's so fun. It stinks because, like, some bosses will, like, bite you out of the sky if you do as it. But, listen, on the bosses that it works on, it works great. <laughs> okay, I need, like, 10k more runes to level up. So I'm gonna pop a... I'm gonna pop one of these things really quick. And then we're gonna level so I don't accidentally just lose it all. There you go. Uh, oh my gosh, Professor, that is so cute. Look, I finally have bottom teeth. That's amazing. Thank you for giving me teeth, Griff. Thank you, thank you. Weather update, you've transitioned from hail to thunder and lightning, but it's still raining. Hey, dude, I love thunder and lightning. I wish it stormed where I live more often. Ugh. I wish, I wish. Okay. I think we're good to level up Dex a little bit. Yeah, Dex will give us more than Arcane does. So there we go. Look at that nice even 40 number. That looks so good. Quotes 64 to 66 have been crazy. Dude, watch quote number 69 be the most tame quote ever. It's it's just gonna be the most say so wholesome. What if quote sixty nine ends up being something like I love you guys or like just something like <laughs> something super super say so you know that'd be so funny. Imagine hail in summer, dude. Imagine. Honestly, where I live, we've actually had snow in the summer a few times. It's very weird every time it happens, but it has happened. Uh, you have a question that's purely hypothetical. If you named your firstborn Skari, would you get a free lifetime sub? <laughs> oh, man. No, 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 no. Listen, listen, listen. You only get that if you give me your firstborn. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Naming, naming is cool. Naming is cool. But uh, no, I need, I, need, I need to actually receive your firstborn in order to get a free lifetime sub. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Have we ever saved a wholesome quote, though? <sighs> You know, <laughs> I want to say that some of them haven't been terrible. Uh, we have. I don't remember the number, though. Yeah, some of them haven't been awful. I don't know about wholesome, but <laughs> you guys throw shit in my head all the time. I should be used to this. Quote number one is, quote number one is tame. Yeah. You remember one of them being a tsundere? Oh, right. Oh, you're right, you're right. There is a tsundere quote in there somewhere. She has beauty, she has grace. I wish she'd kick me in the face. I mean, that's poetry right there. You know, poetry for free. Yeah, yeah. Let me take a drink really quick. I know uh, some of our buddies are stuck in ads, so this is actually a pretty good time for me to take a drink. Uh, you're gonna die because I'm upset. You know, that's, that's a good reason. I mean, yeah. <laughs> Listen, if you blow this for me, I'm gonna blow these for, gosh dang it. Too many monkey, too many monkey quotes. Uh, all right, let me take a drink. Quote 12. Do we not have a quote 12? Wait, did quote 12 get deleted? Did quote 12 get deleted? What was quote 12? Oh. <laughs> Gandalf is bay up. <laughs> ah! <laughs> that was just on cooldown. Okay, okay. I, I For some reason I thought it was a, a personal cooldown. Like a person, you know, like 
for some, for example, Groovy couldn't do, you know, two quotes in more than five seconds, or in less than five seconds, but I guess not. Ugh, Gandalf is Beha Blast. What? How? Why? Just, just, why? Uh I feel like the quotes get slowly more unhinged as we go. Uh, and it's great, it's great. I know there was one quote in there that was something along the lines of like, I want to stick to one game. But I remember why I said that, and that one I feel like needs context every single time that one comes up. Because I'm like, guys, <laughs> it's not what it sounds like. Uh, you will give you the firstborn if you can guess what flavor of dew you have today. Is it the new one? The white one? It's like peach lemonade or something? Please tell me it's the peach lemonade one. Dude, that one is so good. Ugh. Okay, I'm gonna teleport here. And we're gonna start looking for shadow tree fragments over here. I just need one more before I can go back to the putrescent night. Slowly. Uh, I mean, listen. Hey, 14 was pretty tame. I have never been so dis- dis- uh, what's the word? Just, you know, me forgetting- English all the time. Okay, so. This area. Hmm. I feel like there might have been more stuff to explore. I want to go down there because that's where the, these little, like, blue lights in the distance are where the maps are that I haven't gotten. I only have two more maps. So I need to grab those. I don't know if there's actually a way to get down, though. Now that I'm, like, actually looking at it. Mm. Oh, wait, maybe we go up. Oh, regular scar's back. Okay. Um, I think we have to go up from the river. So how does one get into the river? Probably from Castle Front? Yeah. Okay. That looks about right. Aww. Uh, no, but you did have the red and blue ones that were really fruity. Did you like those ones? I thought those ones were pretty good, but I think the white one was my favorite. I really liked that peach, uh, that peach lemonade flavor. It was so good. Oh, I think it's tried its butt whole enough as it is. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that's awful. I'm pretty sure that's a monkey quote. But I could also see that, that being a Dark Souls quote, where it's like, Try finger, but hold. You don't recall the names, but they were very American. They really were. I don't have them anymore, because I think I drank mine yesterday. But, uh, <laughs> they're really good. I really love them. Ugh. Alright, okay, so. We are facing the correct way. We just need to get down into the ravine, somehow? Scary, if you guess correctly, well then, you and Untyped will be forced- No! Never! Never ever ever! I'll be honest though, if we ever do want to have a kid, we will be adopting. I do not want biological kids. That's really unfortunate. You know, I'm gonna blame that on Torrin again. I think that was Torn's fault right there. Yep. After stream, you should go through every quote and write it down. Oh gosh. <laughs> I kind of want to do that as well. I kind of want to, because I think there's one or two quote numbers where I deleted it because it either had context or I just wanted to like correct the grammar. Uh, and I didn't know that if you delete a quote, it makes that number unusable. So I kind of want to go through and just like fix them, you know? So I might have to do that, maybe. Maybe I'll do that today, actually, if I can remember. Uh, today you have code red, so you gotta settle for second born. Gosh dang it, but the second born are never as cool as the first born. You know, coming from the first born. <laughs> no, guys, stop, stop swimming this the folly molt. Guys, guys, listen, it's totally reasonable for people to do just a little bit of falling, okay? It's totally reasonable, okay? It's, it's, it's normal, I swear. Okay, do you guys know how to, do you guys 
guys know how to get over here? I think I need help, because I don't think I can actually reach this area. You have nothing better to do, so you'll go through them after stream. Sounds good, Groovy. I might go through them anyway, just to kind of fix them up a little bit. How about Thirdborn? Well, Thirdborns are actually pretty cool. My- Oh my gosh, you guys, I forgot to tell you! So my brother, right? Brother Frey? I have- Oh gosh. So y'all know how I have like 11 siblings, right? But three of those 11 are like full-blooded siblings, I guess. I don't know how you would say that. Like my mom and my dad were together and they had me and then they had my three siblings and then they got divorced and then I got like a whole bunch of siblings. So like those three siblings are the ones that I'm the closest to because of the ones I grew up with, right? I don't know how you would say that. Full-blooded sounds weird. I don't like the way that sounds. But but, guys, 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 my brother, my brother. I have, like, a special relationship with my brother because we were, like, best friends growing up. Best friends. I love my brother. My brother and I are, like, peas in a pod, you know? Full-blooded. Is that the word for it? That feels, like, weird. But anyway, my brother, he's... <laughs> it reminded me of it because he's the, he's the third born and, you know, him and I get along really, really well. Guys, guess what? I forgot to tell you! I found out... Was it on Monday? I think it was, no, it was on Sunday. I found out on Sunday. I forgot to tell you guys yesterday. He's engaged! I'm so excited! Yes! Brother if I is engaged, I'm gonna cry. It's gonna be amazing. Let's go! Butterfly, butterfly. <laughs> I'm so excited, but is he single? <laughs> no! <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah, no, he's, he's engaged, but he's totally single. Totally. <laughs> he's engaged! They're getting married in December, which is insane. But they're getting married because... Oh! Oh, gosh. They're engaged because... They're getting married super fast because she uh, is going to Europe to do... Uh, to do studies. Study abroad! And they were like, well, we either got to get married or, you know, we either got to get married or break up. And they didn't want to break up. So they're getting married! <laughs> I'm so excited! I love my sister, sister-in-law. I'm gonna, her, her, his fiance? I guess I shouldn't call her my sister-in-law. I love her so freaking much. She's the coolest person ever. I love her! Full blood siblings is such a dramatic way to refer to a sibling, but also fair in the context. Yeah, I don't know what else to call them, you know? Like, I feel weird calling them that because I don't want it. I don't want to make it sound like my other siblings are any less of a sibling because they're not. I consider them just as much of a sibling as, you know, my other siblings, but I don't know how else to phrase it, you know? But yeah. Where is that Breath of the Wild glider when you need it? Dude, you're so right. I wish. I wish. Could you imagine this game with a glider? I don't even know if you can get down there. You you should be able to, right? I just don't know where. Okay, bird. Okay, bird. Also, lion, thank you for the follow. Thank you, thank you. Oh, wait, lion. Sorry, I meant lone. Lone king. Thank you, thank you. Would you be up for a follow for follow? No. No. I don't believe in that at all. Nope. Uh, let's see. We are Harry Potter and the full-blooded sibling. <laughs> that is very Harry Potter coded, isn't it? I kind of love it. Uh, let's see. Okay, how do I get down there? But yeah, I, oh, I keep meaning to call Brother Faye and like talk to him about it. I was going to call him on Sunday, but he was busy. Uh, yeah, I'm... <sighs> I hope that means he's not moving to Europe, because I would probably cry. <laughs> but I guess we're, I guess we'll see. I guess we'll find out. I'll follow you at least. Oh, well, thank you for the follow. Yeah, I don't do follow for follow, because follow for follow is very... Follow numbers don't actually matter, you know? It's, it's, you know, you want, you want, like, actual friends, you know? I don't think follow for follow is the way to do it. But yeah, if you want to stick around and hang out, we have a cute little community. You're always welcome to be here. What if the next game you get to ride a griffin? Oh, I would love that. Dude, there are not enough games out there right now. Oh, do you see that glowy thing down there? Okay, get off Torrent. Torrent's gonna get me killed. Do you see that glowy thing? 
there are not enough games out there on the market right now where you can ride something that flies. Because that's always the most fun part of those kind of games, you know? Just being able to ra fly above the, uh, above the scenery. It's so nice. Ugh. You feel like calling a sibling a half-sibling is worse than calling them a half-blood sibling? <laughs> oh, half-blood is kind of, kind of, kind of hardcore though, right? I usually just call all my siblings siblings, but it gets a little bit confusing when I need to specify, I guess. I don't know. It's very weird. Thank you for the hydrate and the stretch. Also, thank you for the lurk. Thank you, thank you. To be friends on Discord? No. I don't add people that I don't know. Um, but you're welcome to join our Discord. I have had issues with people asking to be my friends on Discord, and then they end up sending me very inappropriate things, and so I don't friend people on Discord anymore. Uh, but if you want, you can always join the Discord. There we go. Stretch achieved. Yeah, so if you want to join the Discord, here's the link. But yeah, I do not add people on Discord because there are lots of people out there who are probably well-intentioned, but end up being very creepy in DMs. And so I just avoid that and, you know, don't do that anymore. Uh, those emotes are so cute, Sky. I love the little heart one. Uh, it makes them sound like less of a sibling just because of the blood, whereas the other way it puts it into context. Yeah, it kind of does actually, kind of does. It also just sounds way cooler, you know? Uh. Yeah, I never know how to refer to siblings because I don't want to make any of my siblings sound like any less of a sibling than they are because they're all my siblings, you know? I love them to the moon and back. It doesn't matter who their parent was, they're my siblings, you know? But it gets confusing when I try to explain, like, which sibling it was or, like, how we grew up or whatever because, you know, the full-blooded siblings, which I hate that name, but, like, they're the ones that I grew up with you know? They're the ones I lived most of my life with, my whole life with. And then it wasn't until I was 16 where I met my stepmom's siblings, or my siblings with my stepmom. I think I was about 16 anyway. Might have been 14. I don't remember. But, uh, you know, it wasn't until I was a teenager. And then I think I was 18 when, like, one of my sisters was born. Uh... And then, yeah, it's so, it just kind of describes like when I guess they came into my life. I'm not really sure. So I guess I could just say the siblings I grew up with, but I don't know. It's very confusing. There we go. I have hydrated. Thank you so much for the hydrate. Thank you. Thank you. All right. All right. Let's go ahead. Uh, do you want directions? Uh, yeah, I would love directions, Christopher. Thank you. Because I feel like there's got to be... There's got to be something down there, right? There's got to be. If you want to go to the entrance of Talana's uh, castle, go left, follow the lower path, and then you come to a swamp, enter the cave of the big flower. Okay. So let's see, Talana... Rolana's castle. Oh wait, Rolana. Sorry, Rolana. Rolana's castle. Okay. So this, so the castle front. Go left. Follow the lower path. When you come to a swamp, enter the cave of the big flower. Thank you so much. The, dude, this DLC is so cool. <laughs> the map is so crazy, but that also means it's really heckin' hard to figure out where to go. Oh, go right. Oh, okay, okay. So, let's see. It'll be, like, this way, then. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I never would have, uh, never would have thought to go this way. Thank you so much. That actually helps out a lot. Mr. Cool, thank you for the follow. It's good to have you. Welcome in. Alright, so go to the right. Follow the lower path. When you come to a swamp. Okay. Is this a swamp? Am I going the right way? Is this the right way? Uh, also, hi! It's good to see you! Welcome in! I hope you're having a good day! Alright. Keep going down here. Oh yeah, I don't think I've been down here yet. 
This map is so hard to get around. It's really pretty. I kind of love the verticality of it. <laughs> but it definitely makes it very difficult to figure out where the heck to go. All right. Enter the cave with the big flower. Oh, there's flowers over there. Are there flowers over here? Just want to make sure I'm not accidentally going too far past it. Mm, no, this looks good. Like you said before, you usually say blood family and found family. Makes them all feel right in your head. But, but they are blood family as well. Well, I guess step, oh, uh, I guess step family would be like found family, right? Okay, so I guess that kind of works. That kind of works. What about the half family, though? My family is so nuts. I have so many siblings. Uh, they are all family. Found family usually consider, usually refers to friends. Ah. Uh, I think, like, the definition is gonna change for a lot of people, but... I do consider one of my sisters... Actually, I talk about her pretty frequently. Uh, one of my sisters that I think I tell you guys about pretty uh, pretty frequently, I, she's technically what you would consider, like, found family, where she's just a really, really good friend that I consider family at this point. Uh, I call her my sister a lot. Okay, so the big flower, there's a cave. I'm just gonna hug this wall until we find it. Uh, maybe down here? If we keep going lower and lower. Oh, there's a dude over there. Oh, oh. Keep going lower and lower. Yeah, this looks like something. This looks like something. Ooh. Oh, this is nice. What is shooting at me? Oh. Okay. Well, time to keep going. No time to stop and admire the scenery. Everything is shooting at me. Oh, this place is pretty. I'm gonna call Scary our pet deer. She's found family, but since she's a deer, she has to be our pet deer. No! <laughs> I am not a pet! I am a living, breathing person! Who just so happens to be a deer! <laughs> you can't have people be pets! That's illegal! <laughs> wow! Oh, deep purple lily. Pretty! Alright, uh, oh, that's a dead end. You actually found your best friend through, through through boxing him? Ever since you've been like brothers? Hey! I love that! That's so cool. Ugh. Yeah. My my sister, I found her through Final Fantasy XIV. <laughs> yeah. And she's amazing. I love her. Neither of us play the game very often anymore. Even though we still we, we still both really love the game. We just don't, you know, actively play it as often but it was great. Scar is very dear to us. <sighs> you know, you, you know, it just... Mm-hmm, yep. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> great, great. Can't have people be pets. I mean, some people are into that. We are not doing puppy play here. That is not a thing. We ain't that kind of channel. I think this is the wrong website for that. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, wait, there's... Two ways to go. Wait. Okay, so we want to go this way. We want to go this way. Yes. Okay. Ah. Uh. You find it interesting that you've had such a bad relationship with your whole family for your entire life, so you would never ever consider calling friends or their sister, though it is a normal thing to do. Oh, you know, that's very fair, Jay. I never really thought of that. I know my sister also has had kind of had a rocky relationship with her family. Uh, she luckily mended the relationship with her parents, but her relationship with her sister was not very good for several years. 
And so for her, it was kind of like a taking back, I guess. You know, the family title. She said that, like, she considers me her sister more than she considers her actual sister her sister. And so for her, it was kind of special in that way. But I could also see it going, like, the opposite way, right? Where, like, you just have such a bad relationship with them that maybe you don't want to associate with them with the... Oh, hi! Like, maybe you just don't want to associate them with that. So I could, I could see that. I could see that. Oh... Uh... It was honestly something I hadn't really considered either for a very long time, but then she started calling me her sister, and I was like, oh! Wait, no, this feels right, this feels right. But yeah, oh, I can see that. Go left and hop down the pillars. Pillars. Are they down here? Pillars? I just kind of started going. Just started exploring. Alright, oh, I'm in combat, so I can't. Uh, okay. I'm just gonna keep going. Lost. You beat the shit out of each other and you were like, Alright, we bros. Heck yeah! Ah, uh, I'm glad. That's always nice to find the people that you get along with like that, you know? Good times. Okay. Okay. Ah, uh, okay. So this was not the right way then. That's awkward. Suck Sky, thank you for the hydrate. Um Okay. Alright. Let me do that actually really quick before I start running off again. Mm -hmm. Okay. So Yeah, okay, this way. I'm just gonna hug the wall, and hopefully that'll get us there. Um, it looked like there were some... Yeah, like these things. Maybe I could parkour my way up that? Usually you fall down those. Oh, actually... Yeah, I don't think I can parkour up. I think you have to fall down. Hmm... Hmm. Well... Uh, yeah. I got the best of directions. No, you're okay. I'm so sorry, Christopher. I think you've done great. It's just... Oh! I'm all... Oh! I'm also just very bad at reading directions. And it's also a very confusing map. Man, thank you for the head pat. Thank, thank you. Oh. Oh, two-headed turtle talisman. Dude, I do not like their faces. I do not like that. I do not like it. I do not like it. No, 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 no. Dang it, I thought that was gonna be it. Uh, eat some stamina food and climb. Boo, dude, I wish. Uh Could you imagine just breath breath of the wilding your way up these cliffs? Genshin impacting your way through it? Uh you would help if you had the DLC. No worries, no worries. Whoop. Angry crab. Whoa. Alright. Crab, can you leave me alone? I'm just trying to vibe. Uh what if? What if? This is probably not it, but... Do we climb this thing? No, probably not. Probably not. Torrent was gonna kick me off anyway. Ah, uh, this stinky little deer horse is such a pain in the butt. This looks like something. Possibly. Uh, nope. Nope, nope. Hmm. You never got on a horse in this game, so IDK had to get to places via horse? Really? But it's so much faster. Why didn't you ever why didn't you ever use torrent? Did you just like taking the slow route or like enjoying the scenery? Cause that would be very fair. 
Rodley Fire. I do not like their faces. You're so rude. Are you saying you do like their faces, Groovy? I don't know. I think they need to get their faces out of my face, you know? They keep just coming all up in my business. It's very rude. Someone stole Mr. Krabs' first dollar. Well, maybe if he had kept a better hold of it. That sounds like a him problem. Not a me problem. Uh, maybe if Mr. Krabs wasn't so goofy with his money. I've never actually seen Spongebob. I know, like, some of the memes, but that's about it. Um... Oh. Could you not spit on me, actually? I'm pretty sure that's considered biological warfare. Stop it. 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 You like their faces? Mmm, I don't know. Well, you know what? In that case, why don't you let them explode in your face? Since you like their faces so much, you know? I think they would appreciate having somebody to explode on. Mm -hmm. Honestly, you don't really know how, and it never really crossed your mind, because you never really had mounts in Dark Souls. Oh, that's fair, that's fair. Honestly, I don't think I would have figured it out either if chat hadn't showed me how. Because using items in this game is not... Like, it doesn't really show you how to do it, you know? You kind of have to figure it out on your own. Hmm. Uh. Where was that? Is this the river cave? Okay, so this is the cave that we came out of. A deer horse is a pain in the butt. Sounds like another deer we all know and tolerate. <gasps> You're right. Haruka from V Shoujo. Gosh dang it. I mean, she's a caribou, but I know what you mean. I know what you mean. <laughs> no, I actually love her. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, Mrs. Haruka from G V Shoujo. Dude, I'm just bashing on all the V Shoujo. <laughs> on Saturday with Sunny, it was Iron Mouse. Today it's. Ow! Oh, oh, jeez. Today it's Haruka. Jake, that was thank you so much for the follow. It's good to have you. Stop it! Uh, a deer horse pain in the butt? Stop it. Get some help. Wait. What was the new quote? Go back to the map real quick. Uh, I will when I get out of combat. Uh, this looks kind of new. Is this new? Did I discover a secret place? I don't think I did, actually. Can I please get out of combat? I just want to look at the map. Please. Please! What is even aggroed to me? Oh, it's you. Can, can, can I get off Torrent, though? Can I please get off Torrent? Please get off the pony. Get off the horse. Jeez. Uh... There we go. Murder that. And then... You gonna... Yeah, okay. There we go. Can I, can I get, oh my gosh, why is it? Dude, this thing follows you. No, 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 Oh. Chris was referring to I think they would appreciate having somebody to explode on Oh, yeah, I can have that as a quote Yeah uh, Let me get somewhere safe uh, Really quick though. Um, okay, that's the cave can, Is this safe? Oh Oh Wait, is this what you meant? To hop along these things? Oh I feel really goofy for not knowing this. Why am I still in combat? There is no way the herb tree is still following me. The the tree spirit thingamajig. 
What is hooked onto me? This is so stinky. Uh, Thursday, Scar is gonna start a war with a ha with with Henya. Oh, not Henya. She's so sweet. Oh boy. Y'all are just gonna find me fist fighting Zen in the parking lot on Friday. It's gonna be awful. All right. All right. Hi, Pokey. It's good to see you. All right. Quote. Add. There we go. Quote number 67. We're getting real close to the uh, the special quote. Uh, Elden Ring aggro be crazy. It's almost as bad as Skyrim aggro. Ugh. Oh boy. We do not want to ride a horse or a cowboy today. <laughs> I do recognize the song. Yeah, um, yeah, no, not, 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 not really into cowboys like that, you know? Not really my kind of thing. Gosh. Oh. Okay. Oh boy. Oh. You know what? That looks more like a Nagitana than a Halberd. Naginata. Oh. It's kind of just like generic fantasy weapon, you know? Uh. Really? I went all that way for a cookbook? Okay. Sorry, right, we'll be like, limes, more like lames. Oh my gosh, I'm just gonna start fights with everyone. Everyone's gonna hate me. That's how Scary gets popular, through controversy. This VTuber said that she hates Matara Khan. Find out what she says next time on things VTubers say. Or something. It'd be crazy. Absolute crazy, I'd just start beef with everybody. I think there's only one VTuber that I said I did not like. And I am not gonna repeat that again because I really don't want to start drama. I do not. I do not. Ay. 69 has to be either crazy as hell or wholesome as hell. It really does. I think it would be really funny if it was actually like super wholesome. <laughs> but I'm not gonna complain if it's also just really crazy because that would also be very funny. Either way, it's gonna be great. VTuber WWE up in here with backstage ambushes and stuff. Absolutely. I'm just gonna start beef with everyone. It'll be insane. This VTuber called Makara Matara Khan is a hag. Derogatory. <laughs> oh man. Oj. Oj. Nah, I don't think I- I don't think I have any right to make fun of old VTubers. Guys, I'm like a few thousand years old, remember? It would be very, very, uh... Uh... What's the word? Contra- no. Hypocritical of me to make fun of old VTubers when I'm a few thousand, you know? Matora No tramp! No! I was once told a coffin could convey its passenger- okay. To the Velvet Garden of Deepest Purple. Oh, to slumber in such a paradise. Okay. Something about riding coffins? Yeah, that's a pretty big theme in Dark Souls games. Like, we've all ridden a coffin once or twice. How are those deer and sheep just vibing right next to the waterfall like that? Those are the world's strongest deer and sheeps. Brothers and sisters are natural enemies, like say-so VTubers and lead VTubers, or 3D VTubers and 2D VTubers, or like VTubers and VTubers! Damn, VTubers, they ruined VTubing! <laughs> I love that! Oh, man. It's time to start VTuber Wars. Vote, vote for your Ushie! Today, see who gets taken out next week. Which VTuber's gonna get cancelled today? Funny. You find it funny how Hag used to be uh, an insult, and recently it's become Hag love, Hag love, Hag love. Yeah, it's been a lot of fun. Let's see, who started that? Was it? I want to say it was like Matara, or maybe it was Amelie. Monarch. I don't know, but it's a very fun little trend. I like it a lot. 
I don't think people realize how old most VTubers actually are. Cause, uh... Listen, guys, VTubing is a lot of money. You think 20-something-year-olds have that much money just laying around? What the heck is... Oh! Torrent! No! Bad torrent! What the frick? Okay. Okay, okay. Do I have... You know what? I don't think I've ever really used a bow in this game. Um, oh. How do you shoot? Oh. Eh? Okay, how do you... Oh! doesn't even stream anymore. Man! How could this happen? Where the frick? Wait, where did my weapon go? Where the frick? Where, oh, where has my weapon gone? Oh, where, oh, where could it be? Ba -da 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 Oh, where, oh, where could it be? Ha! There we go. Uh, use your fey eyes to aim. Well, that just means we're gonna be here all day. All heckin' day. All heckin' day. Oh, this place is neat. Okay, okay. Sorry, you were accidentally giving directions to Cerulean Coast? Oh! You know what? This is okay, though. This is still getting us to new places. I don't mind at all. This is neat. Mushroom cellars, bell bearing. So there might be, who knows? Maybe there's shadow tree fragments over here. Uncharted places. <gasps> Ooh, look at the purple sky. Stop doing things. First you have to have beaten Rolana at the end, then follow the road east until you reach Morith Runes. East, huh? That's the high road cross. Um, so, east? Do, do you mean... To the north of Morith Ruins is a pool with water. There you can find a cave entrance. Oh! Oh! Wait. But how does that get us over here? I'll put a mark on it. Okay. Okay. Thank you. We will definitely check us out. That that brings you over here? That is crazy. This map is insane. Oh, look how pretty the night is. Man. Don't get to see nighttime very often. I hit your ear. Why would you do that? I thought that the We were just having a lovely conversation. Actually, is it because I was making fun of the Vishojo ladies? Listen. I was not. I was not. I love them. Oh. Uh, starting beef with everybody. I'm gonna be just fist fighting everybody in Denny's parking lots. It's gonna be great. What are you? What are you? Wait, you look nasty. What? What? Oh, I can talk to you? Oh. Forager brood cookbook, yellow fulgur. Wait. Huh? Thank you, I guess. That was weird. That was strange. Layered. Like an onion. But, 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 but I'm no ogre. I don't want to think about onions, actually. The pain is too much. Ooh. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. 
Thunder sheep. Thunder sheep. Does whatever thunder sheep does. Uh, is that the dragon? From that really cool dragon place in the distance? Oh, it is. We saw you had 900 points and saw, hey, that's enough for our throat. Rude! Uh, I really don't think I deserve that. I... Did we just pass that guy? How... I am so confused. Oh boy. I did not stop me with her. I did not. Oh, hi, Groovy. <laughs> For real. I did not. I did not. Oh, hi there, mushies. Oh, hi there, chat. I would never. I am unproblematic and say so. Yup, yup. I have never said a mean word in my life. Oh! Oh! Wait a minute. Have we been here? Wait, we've been here. Oh, no we haven't? How did we go through this whole area and I didn't get... I didn't find this grace? Oh my gosh, there's two graces right on top of each other. Well. At least I have a closer one if I ever want to come back to this middle bit. Scary got more beef than a cow VTuber. <gasps> Secretly, Scarry is turning into a cow VTuber upon her 2.0 so that she can start beef with everybody. Everybody. Uh, that movie awakens a primal hatred in you? Really? I've never actually seen it. I've only ever heard quotes of it. Ugh. Okay. Oh! Hi! It's, a uh, Deem? D the, the guy who helped us fight Rolana. What's he doing here? Hello, sir. Huh. Hmm. Okay. Nothing to say. He hates me. I knew it. He thinks I'm smelly. He thinks I should have died when, whenever we fight, whenever we fought Rom Romina? Romina, not Rolana, Romina. He wishes I would have passed away back then. Ah, uh, I knew it. He hates me. Why can I summon here? I don't like that I can summon here. Uh. What manner of boss? Is that a shadow fragment? Let's go! Finally! Also, hello, America. Why is your head gone? Lady, where are all of your heads? Why do none of your statues include your head? Oh. All right. Start just grabbing all these. Oh. Are these enemies? These look like enemies. Yep, they are! Okay, they are. Yep. Mm -hmm. No, they didn't like me doing that. They didn't like me stealing their stuff. Uh, it's fine. We just, uh, go this way. This way, this way. Uh, alright. We could actually probably go try the, the night again, but... Uh, I kind of want to see if I can get that map. That would be amazing. Nope, bad bird. I feel like I've been here before, though. This looks very familiar. There's a... Wait a minute. Can I talk to you, too? I can. Hi! 
That's interesting. Those guys are weird. Okay. Okay. You can stop, Scar. You just have to remind her that it's going to be Octel. You know what? Uh, actually, has anybody seen Tramp lately? I, I don't know where they've gone. They, they, they've, uh... That's so weird. They used to hang out here, you know, and, and chat with us. It was, it was really fun talking to them, but I, I don't know where they went. They, they must have just, uh, disappeared. Like, that's, that's crazy. Who, who, does anybody know? Has anyone seen Tramp? Anyone? I haven't seen Tramp since I was just a wee little fay. Just a wee one. Horn sent to face them, literally. Man, that's so mean. For America. I don't think she deserved that. Probably not, anyway. Uh, oh. Okay. Ah, finally! Thank you so much, Christopher! Alright. Now let's get that map. And then let's go fight the knight. Uh, wow, that's so weird. Tramp just Tramp just disappeared. That's crazy. And that like I wonder where they went. Just you know, disappeared off the face. Wait, do I not have enough to level up my my shadow tree stuff? I thought I thought I just needed one more. You need three now. Ooh. Oh, that sucks. Okay, okay. Well, maybe finding the map will give us another one. Alright, here we go. Uh, when you said poor America, you thought you said you... For, for America? Oh. No. No, no, no. Ooh. Oh, those are enemies. Okay. Dude, you can't look at anything in this game. What is that? I just wanted to see what was over there. Because that looks like something that might... What the frick is that? Sky cheating on her wife with her. Oops. Listen, listen. It's fine, it's fine. I married the whole family, okay? They are very happily all my husbandos and waifus. Every single one of them, I think. I think. I don't know. They're all very pretty. Is there... Usually there's like one around these little soldier encampments, isn't there? Or am I going crazy? What is going on over there? Oh. Hmm. Uh, if you emote, may the best win at Dane, something awesome happens? Really? Oh. I would be tempted to go back, but I... I have a quest. I have a quest to do. Maybe once we see him again, we can try that. Uh, for now, I really wanna... I have a mission. Get the... There we go. I have a mission. I am in desperate need of enough Shadow Tree Fragments. We're one away... We are so close. I just want to explore this whole area. Okay. Yeah, nothing in here. Uh, oh. Uh, torrent, you turn like a, like a, like something that turns very badly. There we go. Yeah. Get out of here, get out of here, get out of here, get out of here. Uh. Ah, yes, the American Fay. Listen, listen, I'm from the Feywild, okay? I have no nationality. Not at all. You all will never know. <laughs> Wee. All right. Uh, am I going the right way again? Yeah, okay, this is, yeah. We're back on track, back on track. I think. Yes, yes, yes! Uh, you remember one of the Civs games where you had America America had good science, so we busted out fighter planes. We were fighting them with cavalry and cannons. 
Oh man, dude, Civilization is wild like that. I haven't played that game in years, but I used to really, really love it. The games just take so long, you know? But it's so fun. Same thing with Age of Empires. I haven't played Age of Empires in a really good while, but I used to love that game. Oh! Oh! It was you who was- Okay. You know what? That makes a lot of sense, actually. We're just gonna run right past you, then. Uh, literally the one. Torrent. Hit it! Torrent is just being a silly, goofy guy, I guess. You know? Sometimes you just gotta be. Ooh! Larval tier. Perfect! Okay. We're going to continue this way. Because the map should be right the frick there! Let's go! Alright. And, uh, Shadow Tree Fangman? Please? Please? Because I got the map? Please? No? What about in here? Temple Town Ruins. Uh, I just need one more, man. Uh, you know a show called American Faye seems like it would be cool? Honestly, I would watch anything that has... Uh, well, actually, that's a lie. I would watch anything that has a realistic adaptation, or like a realistic fae in it. Because a lot of the time, whenever you see fae, they're just like, oh, hee hee, cutesy little fairies, or whatever. It's like, no. No, that's not what I want. I want the spooky. I want the scary fae. The scary fairy, if you will, you know? But where are they? Where are they all? Why are there no scary fairies in media? Hello, Koss! Dude, Koss, are you off your airplane? Welcome back! Actually, I don't know if I should welcome you back. You came in with that joke again. Again, Koss. Again! I'm disappointed. Disappointed. You're how now? You're giga sick, dude! No! Did you get COVID? What happened? Was it the airport? How was your trip, though? I'm sorry you're sick. Hello, church! Real Housewives, the Fae. No! No! I would riot. Dude, I can't open my freaking map. I just want to see where I am. Um. Uh, man. Oh, it's just a cold. That's good, at least. So you got sick, though. Dude, that sucks. I feel like everybody gets sick nowadays when they travel. It's awful. If you could name Torrent anything you wanted, what would you name him? Stupid face, probably. Shit Turner. Cruddy McGee. Aha! This is probably gonna be like a summons level up, but yeah, okay. You know what? I'll take it though. I need more Scatter Tree Fragments. Scadushi Fragments. Hello, Code! It's good to see you! Welcome in, welcome in! Uh... How are there no Shadow Tree Fragments over here? I feel cheated. Cheated. Uh... Man. I came all this way. What if we turn around and head upriver? Maybe there's one like over here? Hmm. Give me the death fairy. That's a real thing. I believe it. Dude, fae are scary. There's a lot of really spooky fairies. Like the she. I keep wanting to call him Sh Sidhi, but I think it's an Irish word or something. And so it's not actually said, pronounced how it looks. It's like she or something. But they're spooky. They're like vampire fairies. It's really scary. Uh, give Scar the red tag, the red caps and the hags. Yeah, red caps are super cool. But exactly, exactly, you guys know what I mean. I want stories about like scary fairies. Why are there none of them? Instead, people just do the exact same, you know, the exact same kind of 
dudes over and over and over again. It's boring. You want Fae pickers to see what kind of stuff the Fae would try to dive and bargain for? Fae pickers? Dude, I just want to see more stories with, like, spooky, accurate Fae, you know? Those guys are interesting. Huh. Red caps, hags, scary mermaids could maybe do something with changelings. Yeah, changelings would be really cool. I want to see something with the she. Oi. Okay, really? Okay. Like, sil silkies. House Fae that bless homes are kept kept nice and comfy. Yeah, those are cute. I thought I thought you were trying to say selkie at first. Those are cute too. Those aren't very scary, but those are nice. You don't really see very many stories about those. Selkies are very cute. Uh, you read a book in high school that you think Sky would have liked? But you can't remember what it was called. Uh, was it... Oh. Oh. Grave. Oh. Oh, that looks nice. Just in the preview. Uh, was it... I think I might know what book you're talking about. If it was a young adult book. Or a kid's book. There was... Ugh, I don't remember what it was called either, though. But it had a brownie that lived in the house. And it was very much about that kind of thing. It was very spooky. Uh... Cartoon Fable Haven? I did actually read Fable Haven. That's not the one that I was. Actually, maybe that was the one I was thinking of. Um, there was another one though. Dude, really? Can you not? Stop. Jeez. That's annoying. Um, no, it wasn't Fable Haven. It was a. Uh... I did read Fable Haven though, and I did like Fable Haven a lot. Spiderwick! That was it! That was it! That was the one! The Spiderwick Chronicles! Yeah! Spiderwick was so fun! Mm-hmm! I don't think I read all of them? Or maybe I did. I actually don't remember. But yeah, I remember loving those as a kid. Those were awesome. Yeah, I read... Uh, Cartoon Saloon has an entire Irish folklore trilogy. Oh, I don't think I've heard of Cartoon Saloon. But yeah, I read Spiderwick Chronicles. I read Fablehaven. Uh, wasn't there another one that was also kind of, like, a spooky, spooky fey or something? I can't quite remember, actually. Dude, I hate that it follows you! Stop! Ugh. These red guys are very annoying. Uh, let's grab our runes. Dude, is there a way to dodge that, or do they just get you? Stop! Ugh. Okay, I'm starting to think there's no way to dodge that. No! Stop it! You almost never think about elves, but you actually don't think that drow are used in media often, are they? Really nasty drow or maybe driders? Not usually. Not usually. I don't know where drow originated from. I think they might be a D and D thing. I'm not super sure. Uh, not entirely sure. I know Skyrim has Falmor. Uh, no. What were they called? The, uh... The Snow Elves. That are sort of like Drow. And the Snow Elves in Skyrim were really cool. Yeah, they're in D&D. &D. Don't know if they originated there. I think they might have... Because they were very tied to Loth, the spider goddess in that universe. Also, Star, thank you so much for the, uh, thank you for the follow. The book series involved a fake king falling in love with a human, and it was their love story. Oh, that's cute. Okay. Uh, Thalmer, yeah! I think I was going to get confused with the Thalmor, the, uh, the uppity high elf s evil people. I cannot believe there is not a single shadow tree fragment in sight. That's insane. Uh, hi, hi. Hello, Star. It's good to see you. I hope you're having a good day. Welcome in. It's interesting how kobolds used to be canine in design until the last iteration or two when they became reptilian. That always confused me a little bit. Yeah. 
I wonder why they made that change. I mean, I like kobolds both ways, but it's very interesting. It's also kind of funny to watch how people, <laughs> people have gone from like, yes, goblins, evil, just nasty, horrible, evil goblins, hate goblins, kobolds too, evil. And now, <laughs> ooh, rune bear. Now it's more like goblins, friend-shaped, cute, fluffy, adorable, small, cute, <laughs> little friend, tinkerer. <laughs> And I like both of them very much. I think they're both great. Yeah, dragon and puppy kobolds are both great kobolds. They are. Whoa, look at that bear! That is the bear to end all bears. Ooh, that is definitely a boss, huh? Should I fight it? Is there a grace that's a little bit closer? I doubt it, but I kind of want to see just... Because I know I'm probably going to die. Glory to Tyre? That's kind of neat. Okay. Uh, I want to fight that. I want to fight that. They're just domesticating them. Oh, that's a cute way of thinking of it. I had a... So goblins in my D&D &D setting usually are evil, but um, <laughs> you can actually like talk to and reason with them. And so I had a D&D &D party one time that I was DMing for, and they ended up adopting a goblin. They would give him, like, magic weapons and armor and, you know, just absolutely spoil the heck out of this goblin. Because if anything happened to that goblin, they were going to go on a war path. And so they're like, he has to be able to protect himself. Give him all the magic knives. <laughs> it was very cute. I loved that goblin. Good little goblin. Hi, Moon. It's good to see you. Welcome in. You like the nasty and the friend-shaped goblins? Me too. I like both of them. It's very funny to you when people who love kobolds play your D&D &D game and learn that they're canine in your world. Really? Wait, why does that drain the enthusiasm? They're both so cool. I like canine goblins. Or, sorry, kobolds, not goblins. They're both very cool. Dude, I can have Mimic for this? This is, must be a heck of a bear. People like to depict female goblins as cute and the male goblins as nasty, but you like both for male and female or somewhere in the middle? Me too. I think if you're going to make the female goblins cute, you have to also make the male goblins cute. I don't think you can do one or the other. You either make both of them a cute or both of them nasty. Or both of them, like... Rugal... Rugalea? Ooh! Okay! But yeah. Uh, do the same thing for both of them, you know? I think I just accidentally dodged a move there by jumping up over it. That's kind of fun. Big bear, big bear. Big bear, beware! Oh. Oh. Smack Double time. Smack, smack. Double. Oh, okay. Ooh. Ow. Uh-oh. Warcraft, they use the canine design as well. Oh, I like both of them. Oh, dude! It made the atmosphere change. Look, it's all, it used to be all like spooky and dark and now it's all orange. Either that or it just turned to daytime and I was uh, in the middle of fighting this dude. It was just a huge coincidence, but I like to think it was the bear that caused it. Mm-hmm. This guy is so cool! I love bears. Bears are my favorite animal. Oh dear. Oh dear. Alright. Come here, you! Ah, dang it. Okay. Oh uh, no, Mimic! Mimic! I swear, Mimic is the main character. Mimic is getting all kills. Heck you, Mimic! Roar of Rugalea. That is so cool! Did it drop a grace? A grace? A grass? A greasy grass grass? Bernstein bear! I don't know, it looks a little spookier than a Bernstein bear. It's uh, the Bernstein bear's angrier cousin, Fred. 
Also, why is it that every single name, or at least half the names in this game, start with R? So many R names. Okay, where are we? Oh, man. The book is called Wicked Lovely. It actually involves the fake quartz, which not many books do. That's kind of fun. I, I don't know if I would personally be the biggest fan, just because I'm not a big fan of modern settings. I get really bored of modern settings. But, that does sound nice. It's very nice that it involves the quartz, too. That's a lot of fun. You always used to the canine uh you've always used the canine cobalts because that's what they were when you started playing and you never bothered to switch hey that's fair i think cobalts were reptilian when i started and so i ha i don't have a whole ton of experience with the puppy ones but they're super cute i really like them all cobalts are good cobalts Knolls are really cool too. Knolls are terrifying and they are underused. I think gnolls are amazing. I love having my players fight gnolls because they hear the word gnoll and they're like, oh yeah, those are like the dog things, right? And I don't think they realize just how scary gnolls are. And so I'm always able to spook them. They end up being really tough fights. It's great. Oh, Marika, Radagon. Ah, dude. Radagon, Rinala, Rolana, Rickard. Then there's also a lot of G names as well. Godric, Godfrey, Gandalf, you know. Uh, stop. Avert your gaze from me. I beg, look away. Ah! Dude, really? I'm trying to talk to an NPC. Go away. Get out of here! There's the Iron Face series as well. It was okay in the beginning, but not so much at the end. That always sucks when a series is like really good to be good. Ugh. When a series is really, really good to start off and then it kind of just goes downhill. That happens far too often. Ugh. You find it interesting. It's kind of seeing how the Fae would have adjusted to a more modern setting. Yeah. Like, it's a lovely take and everything. I know a lot of people like that. It's just not usually what I go for when I pick a book, a book you know? But it is kind of fun seeing that stuff. I know there was a book I read where it was like Greek gods uh, adjusting to modern settings. And I don't know, like it's, it's interesting. I think a lot of people, a lot of people like those kind of books, but I don't know. I just, I just don't, they're not for me. I, I have lived in the modern setting, you know? The modern setting is what we're going through today, and I'm sick of it. No modern for me. I wish to be taken away, spirited away to somewhere else when I read a book. It's escapism for me. I don't want to be reminded of the day-to-day. -day. The day-to-day -day sucks. Oh. At least it isn't something like a false hydra or anything. Oh, gosh. Oh, boy. You know, I've never actually used a false hydra, but they are a very interesting kind of dude. Hi there, you. I'm just- dude, I'm vibing. Do you have to be- do you have to be that way? Really? Come here. Come on. I'm sorry. You attacked me first. A rap key. I'm just exploring. Don't gotta attack me like that. Ooh. The reptilian draconic switch happened sometime in 3E. You believe it was a dragon magazine that first published them, and then people really liked them, so they ran with making them canonically dragon offshoot things since then. They are kind of fun as little draconic offshoots. Oh man. Maybe one of these days I should give running those, like, kind of more doge kobolds a try. Uh, that was a big wind-up, sir. There we go. Right. Lots of ways to go. She really tried sneaking Gandalf in there. Well, it worked. None of you would have said- None of you- Like, none, nobody would have noticed Groovy if you hadn't said anything, okay? I almost got away with it. <laughs> I think of it, you might make kobolds canines in the Weird West campaign that you're writing and use coyotes as the base animal. Ooh, 
Ooh, that's a really fun idea. You should. I like that. Griff, you love all kobolds, but your favorite might be the goofy Pathfinder kobolds with the massive heads. Those ones are so cute. I love Pathfinder leshies. The little plant people. What the heck? Wait, what the? What the? Is it that? The frick is going on? Ew, no, okay, no, 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 no. I don't want whatever that buildup is. We don't do that here. Uh-uh. Why did that not hit? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Why are you farting? Uh, am I allowed to ask what boss we're at? We are at the Putrid Night still. I have been searching for shadow tree fragments this entire heckin' time. And I found one, but then I realized we needed another. So we're still at the Putrid Night. We're just been, we've just been exploring. We found this map. We beat up a giant bear. Um, I think that's about it. But welcome back, Drizzle, welcome back. Oh, thank you for the hydrate. Uh, let me do that real quick. No modern, but what about the future? Um, I'm not the biggest sci-fi person. I, I'm so sorry, guys. I'm, I'm unfortunately like really picky when it comes to, <laughs> when it comes to that kind of thing, but I'm a pretty big fantasy nerd. I don't really read books very often if it doesn't take place in a fantasy setting. But it really depends. Thank you for the hydrate and the stretch. All right, one second. Mm -hmm. Ugh. Thank you so much. Uh, putrescent night. Mm-hmm. Stinky skelly man. I just want one more shadow tree fragment. One more skibbity fragment. And then we'll be good. But dude, they're spaced so freaking far out. Okay, we gotta run. Cause that guy's a jerk. Oh, can we make it? Yeah, I think we got this. Yeah, we're good, we're good. Here we go. Hey! What the frick? What? All right, all right. Time to power for the dungeon with the power of chickens. Hey! Or not, or die. Dying works too. fantasy. Give me wizards and dragons and merfolk. Same. Same. If it doesn't have magic, I'm not interested. I just want a setting that is not... I don't know. I just want a fantasy setting that is not just Earth, you know? I love world building. It's so fun! It doesn't even have to have magic, honestly. As long as it's, like, fantasy enough, I guess. Have you guys ever read the Eyes of God series by John Marco? Like, I would say that's a very low magic setting, but it is so good! I love it. You're just asking because you're curious. You said, not now, you didn't know if it included the, the future? <gasps> yeah, future is fine. I'm more of a, I'm more of a fantasy person though. But I will say future is better than present. I just, I just don't like stuff that takes place in the modern day. My escapism cannot escape hard enough when that happens. Ah, oh, but welcome in dark, hello, hello, it's good to have you. You vibe with the nitty, with the gritty swords and the sorcery stuff? Yeah! Like the Elder Scrolls and Dragon Age. Mm-hmm. Okay, uh, this looks like a trap. This looks... Was it not a trap? Oh! All right. All right! No! Bad! Stop! Here we go. Get your blowy friend to stop doing that. All right. Come here, you. Can you even bleed? I don't think you can! Oh. 
Well, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. What? Uh, you adore cyberpunk stuff? Some dude, cyberpunk is a really cool aesthetic. Oh, cyberpunk. What was the anime that like made everybody cry? Cyberpunk sixty four or something cool? Oh, jeez. What the heck? That was a really cool anime. I loved that anime. All right. All right. Oh, jeez. No. Oh. Yeah, Edge Runners. Yes, Edge Runners was so good. What is that? Oh. Oh, you love Edge Runners. It changed your life. Edge Runners is amazing. I want it to get a second season so bad. I know it's probably not going to, but hear me out. I just want more stories in that world because it was so good. Loved that series. Kagrill, hello! You still haven't watched it? Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, no spoilers. No spoilers. But it's an amazing series. Definitely highly recommend it if you haven't seen it. It's super good. Uh, let's go over here and then we can jump down. Oh, how are you, dear lady? I'm doing great. I'm having a heckin' good day. Oh, I was too late. Too late. Uh, yeah, it's been a really good day. I think it's Thursday. Tuesday, 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 not Thursday. Uh, I think it's the second season, just get new characters. Exactly, exactly. Just different stories in the same world, you know? I would love that. I just think the world is super cool. Hi! Hello, hello! I'm just gonna steal your item and run! Or not, or not, or not, or not, or not! Oh, sorry, I'm sorry! Okay. Oh, uh. They're making a new cyberpunk game. Oh, hey, well that'll be fun. I haven't even played the first one yet, but I kind of want to after watching Edge Runners. <laughs> oh, they had so many cool things in there. It was awesome. You love technomancy, like in Starfinder. You play them as having a tablet as a spellbook. Ooh, that's kind of a fun implement. Yeah. Ah. Oh. Man, whenever the new Edge Runners, Edge Runners game, whenever the new Cyberpunk game comes out, might have to might have to give that a try. I still have to play the old one though. Did you know Lucy is going to be in Guilty Gear Strive? Really? That's so cool. I love Lucy, dude. Her outfit is so pretty. I was kind of tempted after watching Edge Runners to see if I could give Scary. Some kind of cyberpunky outfit that was sort of like Lucy's. But, uh... <laughs> I probably won't be able to do that for a while. Uh, you're not sure if it's exactly your kind of game, but I enjoyed it. I think I would enjoy it. I kind of like, uh... Those kind of open world... Okay, I'm gonna get hit here, that's fine. I kind of like those, like, open world exploration RPG kind of games. Like, Fallout, for example, isn't a setting that I usually enjoy, but I liked it just because of the, uh, kind of open-world RPG aspect of it. Jeez! Oh! Gosh dang it, I just want the item! Black Knight Captain... Okay. That's cool, that's cool. Okay. That's fine. We got the item. Uh, Skari streamed the game? Oh, Cyber... Cyberpunk? I'd be down. Oof. i just see if it runs on my computer first. <laughs> but yeah, I'd be down sometime. I have been kind of wanting to go through and play some of those RPGs that I've never gotten around to. Like Fallout, Cyberpunk, the old Elder Scrolls games especially. The old Elder Scrolls games look like so much fun. Ranma... One half we make. Oh god, what? Run my one half. I don't think I've heard of that. What is that about? Oh, well done, Netflix. Dude. If it's on Netflix, I will probably watch it. I don't want to buy a Crunchyroll subscription because I hate that everything is a subscription nowadays, but 
Dude, Netflix has some pretty good anime, you know? World building question. Is it moral to use steam methods as fuel for a train? Are those like little steam spirits? I don't know if it's moral, but it's interesting. You should do it. You should do it, Leon. Mm-hmm. Uh, stream cyberpunk. I would be down. I'd be super down. If it, if it, you know. If I can run it. Gosh dang it, why did I have to put the runes right there? You know what? Here, maybe I do this. Maybe I lead him over here. Come on. Oh! Gosh dang it. Ah! There we go. There we go, suckers. Oh. If you can run Elden Ring, you can run Cyberpunk. Probably. Yeah. I think it'll be alright. Then again, Skyrim. Skyrim kind of gave my computer issues, but that's... That's Skyrim, so... Kind of expected. Okay, sir. Sir. Okay, I'm just gonna run around you, grab these, there we go. And we run. You need to watch Edge Runners. You should, good luck. It's a really, really good anime. Highly recommend it. Gosh dang it, I was... No, get me out of the corner, get me out of the corner, get me out of the corner. Oh, you took like no damage from that. Okay. Oh, you are tanky. Ow. Oh, nice. Ow. Less nice, less nice, less nice, less nice. No, not the wall! Ugh. Whatever. At least my runes are back here, so I don't have to go try to scrape them out of the place with three dudes again. Uh. Let's see. Uh. You just have to adjust the settings. Yeah. I mean, that's, that's true for any game, you know? It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Yeah, we, should, we could definitely play that at some point. Oof. It's in your top three, and it ain't number three. Yeah. It looks like a really fun game. I know Untyped really liked it. He played it for a little while. I think the only reason I didn't play it was just because I was doing something else. I don't really play a ton of games in my free time, actually, anymore. Usually I just stream games with you guys, and that's kind of my game time for the day. I don't really play games very often outside of that. Uh, they redid their entire balance tree, so it's a totally new experience. Oh, nice! I heard it had a really big update a few months ago, kind of around the time that the anime was really popping off. So that's kind of fun to hear. Hi, placeholder! Hello! From a spooky tree to spooky catacombs. Spooky catacombs that keep smushing us. I do not appreciate the smush. Why did that- Oh. Heck you, little dude. Man. Get shrecked. Oof. Have we seen the spooky forest? You guys keep talking about the spooky forest, but I don't know if we've actually seen it yet. Oh, uh, let's see. Yeah, we can drop down here. Why not? There we go. Any little dudes? Oh, hi, it's these guys. Yeah, I loved you in Dark Souls 1. Yep. Oh, please don't. Please don't. If that's... No, you guys have the worst status effect again. Ew. No. Okay, I'm just gonna run. Just gonna run. Not gonna deal with that today. Uh, okay. Climb, climb, please. Ooh. Do not smush the fae. The fae does not. The fae does not wish to be smushed. The fae just wishes for shadow tree fragments, and they are not forthcoming. Very rude, actually. I'm very offended by it. Hi there. Meow. Uh. Oh, what the? Where did you come from? Very rude, though. Don't you know better than to backstab people? Did they climb the ladder? 
They must have, right? Ugh. Stream time for you. Hope you have a fun day. Thanks for stream. Hey, have fun, Code. Thank you so much for hanging out. I hope you have a fun time at the gym. We'll catch you later. Have fun, have fun. Ugh. Okay. We are safe. No, we're not. Heck, you little bomber guy. Pass away. Become one with the rest of the stones in this place. This looks like the start. Wait. We just came from here. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, so that wasn't the right way to go. Uh. What's that little bit of gold? Oh, it's a item. Um... Is that all this place has? Usually this place has ended a boss. No boss? Thank you for the stretch drizzle! Uh, placeholder. I see her disliker of the silly little death frogs. I think they're cute. Ugh. Big stretch. I think they're cute. I just, man. I do not like the death condition. It's very rude. Uh, but I do think they're cute. They're just annoying. Oh, jeez. Okay. Come on. Get stomped. Oh, jeez. Nope. Not stomped enough. There we go. There we go. Smoosh. Get smooshed. It. Come on. Come on, you're close enough. Yeah! Come try to fight me! <gasps> yeah, you know you want to. You know you want to. Smoosh! I love that. I love that. Dude, those guys have so many smithing stones! Alright. Alright. Bingo! Right answer. Yeah, they're cute. They're very adorable. They're just a little smelly, you know? I don't think anybody would agree with, you know, disagree with me that they're a little smelly. A little bit too smelly. Ba -ba -ba. Oh. Oh. There we go. Oh. Really? Didn't drop anything? That's kind of rude. Okay. So... Is this not the way to go? Hmm. Maybe it was just an item over here. Huh. Well, alright. That's awkward. Okay, time to head back to the entrance then and keep looking for fragments. I'm tempted to just... Gosh dang it, I can never make that in time. I'm tempted to just, uh, try to try- try to fight the knight. Without getting any fragments. Cause... I don't know, I'm not having a whole lot of luck. Maybe I can get up there somehow? Hmm... Oh shoot! Right. Oh, right, 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 right. I just wanted to look. Hmm. There's one of those little death spewy things. Is that a frog? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know where to go. All right. We're not gonna make it. No. Nope. Okay. Okay. There we go. Ugh, ribbit, ribbit. They're very cute. They're just very smelly. Stinky little fellas. Stinky little dudes. Okay. Uh, yeah. I thought 
this place would have had a boss, but I am either... Is this a invisible wall? No? Okay, so this place probably just doesn't have one. Or I am too blind to see it. Uh, right. Gotta go fast. Okie dokie. No, please don't death me! I'm so close to the end! There we go. We're fine. We're safe. No! Okay. Well, mostly safe. It does have a boss? I've been through this whole place like two or three times now and I cannot find it. Oh. It's just a long catacomb. Wait, it does or it doesn't have a boss? Uh, maybe it's one of these walls and it's just trying to be sneaky. Trying to pull a haha -ha silly about thing. There is a boss, but where was it? Uh, I don't know where to go. Alright, let's get our Estus flasks back at least. I guess we can keep looking. My guess is maybe it's down... Kind of down where the death frogs were. Uh, thankfully the bosses aren't required. Yeah, but they're fun. Oh, hello. Uh, also, hello, Capital. That's good to see you. Thank you so much for the follow. Unless you're a completionist. True! They're just kind of fun, you know? I don't think it'll give us, like, anything that we're actually gonna use, but I just think they're fun. Thank you for the head pat. Thank you, thank you. Let's see. My guess is... Also, thank you for the lurk. Uh, my guess is that it's gonna be... Ooh, jeez. Down here. Down, 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 down. Bum, 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 bum. Alright, alright. We're safe. <laughs> thank you for the hydrate. Thank you, thank you. Ooh, look at those cute little death frogs. Um, yeah, we're gonna go this way instead. I never noticed the death frogs have like that little bit of blue kind of popping out from their scales. Or, I don't know, but they have a little bit of blue on them. That's kind of cute. Let's see. Come on. Up here. Okay. Oh, no. Thank you for the hydrate. Let me do that while I... I guess I can actually do that while I'm climbing the ladder. Oof. Almost out of water. Okay. Hello? You guys coming up? There you are. Hi. Unfortunately, I don't really want you up here, so... Sorry. Is your friend gonna join us? Or is your friend, uh... Nope, they seem to be having some trouble there. Okay. Deathblight is your favorite condition in your game? You just wish that you could use it too? Really? What makes it your favorite placeholder? <laughs> Life could be a dream. Ugh. It would be... So silly, if you could have it. I could see it working for like little dudes, maybe. Maybe not bosses. <laughs> Might be a little strong if you could have it for bosses. Uh. Okay. I, yeah, I don't know where it is. Okay, I'm gonna leave. <laughs> I tried, I tried. Why? Player usable sources of death blight will never be viable. No, but it could be silly. Oh! Oh, shoot. <laughs> also, hi, Alex! It's good to see you! Welcome in, welcome in! Alrighty. Onward! The search for scooby dooby 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 fragments continue. Ugh, this is not the place. Alright. Hello, little guy. Goodbye, little fella. 
Please don't death me. Which catacombs is this? This is the... Uh... Oh dear. Oh dear. Uh, I can tell you in Scorpion River Catacombs. There we go. Uh, the black and yellow is so pretty. You want the funny death mist? I love black and yellow as a color combination. It's so pretty. It really, really is. Ugh. I think the closest we're gonna get is that, like, death fire kind of stuff. Stop throwing things! Uh, death fire. Hi, sir. Stop. Avert your gaze from me. I beg, look away. Ah. Okay. Okay. No need to be dramatic, sir. No need to be dramatic. If death blight bad, then why pretty? It's a good question. It's a good question, placeholder. Do you think we'll ever get the answer to that? Uh, it's because from self taints us. Not allowed to have the pretty. <laughs> Those scorpion dragonflies are terrifying. Okay, I am still mad that there is not a single shadow tree fragment in this little area right here. This feels like the perfect place to drop one, you know? We should totally have one. Okay. Uh... Maybe we just go fight the knight, because... Dude, we've been searching for... Over an hour? Hour and a half? Longer? Two hours? I think two hours now. Not including all the time we've spent searching for them on other days, and we just are not finding these things. Uh, let's see... Maybe over here? <sighs> you want to build up the instant kill meter like it's stance breaking in Sekiro? That would actually be kind of fun if they did make it very Sekiro-like. <sighs> Look at that bear. That bear got no cares. Just living his very best life. Oh, there's another one. Alright. If there's a nun up here, I riot. I just start crying uncontrollably. It'll be awkward for everyone involved. Come on. Don't make don't make me don't make me do this game. Come on. Come on. It's a no-care bear. For real! Look, the Care Bear's worst enemy. Feuded to fight for eternity. Fated to fight for eternity, even. Fated to feud? There we go. Game, you're gonna embarrass me in front of all the mushies. Game, are you really gonna make me just sob uncontrollably for hours on end? I don't think that's very nice of you. Not very nice at all. Okay. Well, I, I guess I guess we're just sobbing for the rest of the evening. Yup. Ah, uh. oh, man. Okay. Yep. We've already been here before. Man, not a single shadow tree fragment in any of this area. This whole heckin' river. Hey, let's go! Ah! Orochi, I don't need any help getting the waterworks going. They're already here. We've seen you dodge these dangerous attacks many times a plenty, but can you dodge these? H have, have you seen me dodge them? I mean, I think, uh, 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 I mean, yeah, no, I dodge all the time. I'm a great dodger. I'm the, the, the dodgiest, the do dodgiest of dodging. Let's, yep, 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 yep. No Scooby-Doo fragments. Unfortunately not. The Scooby-Doo fragments live another day. Ugh. Why do they hate us? Why do they wish to evade us? What have I done to make the Scooby-Doo fragments hate me this much? Ugh. I don't understand. 
I have been nothing but good to them. And this is how they repay me. Supposedly, there's enough Scooby-Doo fragments to get you to level 20. But I'm at level 9 and I can't find a single one of these suckers. Did you beat the boar rider? I haven't, but he scares me even worse than the Skelly Knight. I can try to fight him again, but I'm gonna lose my I'm gonna lose all my souls. I I can't fight him. Or, well, who knows? Maybe we, maybe we've somehow powered up enough to be able to fight him. But he's tough. I don't know. I was getting one shot. Shadow view. Okay, how many runes am I losing? Ninety-four thousand. I think I might want to level up a little bit before we try to fight him because I know I'm gonna lose him. Okay. So we need, oh, that's a lot of runes. 176,000. So, let's go ahead. Mm. Use one of these. And then we need about 30,000 more. And then we can try to fight that dude. It's- I can guarantee you it's gonna go poorly. This guy hates me. Ugh. Tough boss. Okay. Um... Maybe we do Dex? Mm. Uh, I don't really know if it's worth it to level up. I don't know. I feel like we're in a pretty good spot. Uh, maybe mind. I don't know. Dex. Why not? Why not? Just keep leveling Dex. Believe, Scary. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll do my best. This is why you stopped playing after the main game. Oh, I'm sorry, Lost. To be fair, I'm having a really fun time with it. The bosses are just very difficult. Uh. All right. Hi there! Well, oh, dang it, didn't dodge fast enough. Yeah, see, look. Over half of my health in one freaking hit. Very hard time dodging them, too. Okay. Nope, that was the wrong potion. That's okay, it wouldn't have saved me anyway. Oh. You won't die if you get hit. Or if you aren't hit. Are you sure? about that. Uh, oh, seven. Hi, here. It's good to see you. Welcome come in, welcome come in. Alright. We can try again, but I think it's gonna be the same thing. Wait, why didn't it? There we go. Drink our potion. Uh, Alright, this is gonna... Yep. Oh, I did it! Let's go! Whee! Dude, mimic and I synchronized uh, flippy flapping. Oh, come on. Not in the wall. Not in the wall. Not in the wall. Not in the wall. Oh. Hi, Blue. Or Bill? Hi, Bill. Try rolling forward. All right. Uh, oh. Oh, he got stuck on mimic or distracted. Okay. I will give that a try then. Dude, he takes no damage from me either. I think I'm I think I have a better chance of yeah, with a skeleton boss than I do with this guy. This guy still gives me trouble. I'm also not entirely sure where Mesmer is, but I also wonder if we're supposed to fight Mesmer before this guy. Uh just curse him, you know his name after all. Well, well I mean, listen, I I, I mean, I totally could, you know, but, uh, what if I just, uh, what if I just don't feel like it? What if I feel like, uh, fighting him the legit way? Totally. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> that's why, that's why I'm not doing it. Totally, totally, totally. Taking hit equals damage. Not taking hit equals no damage. I think that's fake, actually. Um, I'm pretty sure that if you die enough times, uh, you become Super Saiyan, and you just one-shot the boss after that. <laughs> You can fight Mesmer before fighting that guy. Man. Yeah, everyone keeps telling me that Mesmer is in this area. But I swear, I've explored every freaking room in this place. Have 
haven't been able to find him. Also, thank you for the follow. Uh, what if you curse the Fae? I'd like to see you try, Groovy. Do it, you won't. Oh, oh gee, you think the Fae and Gaius would get along? They are both legless. I am, I am not legless. I have legs. They're very good legs. Y'all are just jealous. Uh, you wish you had legs as good as me. Is this because I have hooves and you guys don't? You jealous of my hooves? Whee! The one time I will accept the starry fall emote because yes, that was a fall. Ow! All right, I gotta get the timing on this guy's attacks down because they are a little bit wonky. Sir, can you stop being all over the place? I'm actually kind of trying to hit you, you know? Oh. He's not doing as much damage to us as he was before, which is nice, but still, it hurts like a mother tucker. Okay. Yeah, that, that makes sense. That checks out. Uh, you can give you a tip to get to Mesmer if you don't mind. Uh, no, that's okay. We're not doing Mesmer right now. Right now, we're trying to get past this putrescent knight dude. We've been trying to search for shadow tree fragments all day today. We haven't been able to get him. Those stinging fragments are evading me, I swear. Curse of Skeleton Fight. I want to see what's behind this dude. But... Yeah, this guy just stinks. I curse you to remember the nameless exists. Heck you. Wow! Okay! What a curse. You know what? Heck you. I'm not gonna look at chat anymore. Nope. Chat, who's that? I don't know what mushies are. Crazy. Well, what are, what are mushies? That's insane. It sounds made up. Like a figment of your imagination. You know, I don't think that butterfly move is ever useful in this fight. Gosh dang it. It's so hard to tell where the frickin' horse is! Ow. Okay, okay, okay. Alright! Oh! Okay, this is the thing where you jump. Whoop. And whoop. And whoop. There we go! There we go! Please do not do that again. You're gonna do it again, aren't you? Yep, yep, there we go. Sir, if you could not, that would be much appreciated. What are you doing? Oh. Okay. Oh, I thought he was gonna charge. Nope. Dude, it looked like you staggered for a second there. So delayed! Stop it! Ugh. Let me smack! Let me smack! No! Dang it! Ah! she's a man abandoned! <laughs> oh, man. Wait! time that Mimic has done that? Um, why is it that only this time it counts, but any of the other times it didn't? Huh? Mimic has done that three times now! Gosh dang it, Mimic is the main character! I, uh... <laughs> why? <laughs> Mimic is better. It is! Mimic just can get good, and I can't. Oh, yeah. This is awful. Okay, okay. Here we go. Where is the... Where did it... Where are the runes? Where are they? Dude, if it doesn't give me the runes for this fight, I'm gonna cry. That would be awful. Hey, I got him! All right, all right. Jeez, uh... Mimic is Oshi. For real. 
Mimic is the true hero, not me. I'm just the nerd that summons it. But could Mimic have done it without you? I don't know. Some of these fights, I wonder. I, 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 uh, I think it might be able to. Torrent is the main character? Torrent keeps killing me! I am a Torrent hater. Ugh. Torrent is stinky. We are not friends. Finally, I can see what's behind this dude. All right. Huh? Lots of nectar blood virgins. Is that an NPC? Doesn't look like a person. It is a person. It's a flower. It's a flower person. Oh, wait, there it is. There's their face. That's a... Okay, you're a... Uh... I can't tell if that's a flower holding a baby or if that's, like, a person who has become a flower. St. Trina, your love. There's that other NPC's love that we met as well. Imbibe Nectar. Uh, okay. Oh, I don't know if we should have drank that. Oh, yeah, that... Oh! Wow. Okay, I was right. Should not have drank that, actually. That was a very bad idea. Mm. Okay. Does that do anything, though? Do we get, like, superpowers from it now that we're dead? Now that we've died? Oh, item. What's this? St. Trina's Disciple Cookbook. Very cool, very cool. Do I talk to her again? Hi. She's so pretty. Uh, imbibing nectar five times a day to keep a healthy, balanced diet. For real. Oh. I'm kind of tempted to attack her. I think that's a bad idea, though. Uh, you have to drink that twice? Five times total? Wait, really? You guys aren't messing with me? Okay. Alrighty. Uh, this place does have some worth, but you have to imbibe five times. Okay. Do we become plant? It's lore! Ah, alright, alright. I'll die five times for the pretty plant mom. It's fine, it's fine. We we can take it. We're strong. It's all good. I love that emo ear. That is so cute. Oh, man. Okay, okay. Well, we're gonna keep dying then. Uh, don't mind me. I'm just trying to become a plant. I guess. I want a lily to grow out of my head, too. Please. Hmm. We literally cannot die. No, 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 no. We can die. We just come back afterwards. Hmm, hmm. We are the world's spookiest zombie. All right. Oh, 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 oh. Wait, you know what I can do? You know what I can do? In honor of the occasion. Da, da, da. I think this is fitting. There we go. It's perfect. There we go. Very fitting. Very fitting. You think they're messing with y'all, but what do you know? Oh. Well, I mean, that was... What was that? That was death number three, I think? Eh, it doesn't hurt to check it out. We're not losing runes or levels or anything, so... We're all good. How does the nectar taste? It tastes like, uh... Grape... Li grape flavored flower juice. It's very weird. Very floral and fruity. I like it. <laughs> uh, so we're Starscream from Transformers. <laughs> I've never actually watched the Transformers animated movie or shows or anything. But, sure. Heck yeah. 
She has a really pretty voice. Oh dang, okay. Wow. Oh. Dude, I'm loving the little bits of lore we're getting. What is Nicola up to? Can we do it again? What happens if we do it one more time? She's so pretty. Plus, we might outsleep this game's atheist little bitch. What? I mean, that would be amazing, but I wanna, I want the sleep though. I want it. I can't have it. Uh, I assume it tastes like grape cough syrup. But, I don't know. I think it would have kind of a pleasant taste. Stop. Why are you throwing things at me? I'm right. Also, hi Merlin. Thank you for the head pat. Sanctuin is your favorite. Nicholas prison. A cage divinity is beyond saving. Her voice is so pretty. Oh. All right. Let's keep talking to her. I want to see what she says. She has such a pretty voice. For some reason, somebody said something, like one of the NPCs said something a while ago that made me think that Saint Trina and Mikola were the same thing. And I don't know, I don't remember what it was. Uh, Heck Mikola for abandoning Saint Trina. Oh, was that what that was? Oh. I thought that, yeah, for some reason I thought that they were the same person. They are the same person? Oh, is it like a they split themselves type deal or something? Sad. Uh, it's like how America, America is Radagon. Oh, that makes sense. Okay, okay. Have you ever seen America and Saint Trina in this? <laughs> Mikola and Saint Trina in the same room together? Listen. <laughs> All right. That was probably the last thing she says, huh? Hmm. Okay. Dang. All right, all right. Man, I'm glad we came here. We should go to the NPC. This guy. The guy who was in love with St. Trina. We should talk to him, see what he says. Okay, soldier, you haven't seen Fire Giant and Godric the Grafted in the same room together either. <gasps> Holy crap, placeholder. I think you're onto something. You should look into that. We should, we should, we should, we should, we should research that. Something I wish to tell you. Oh. I think so. I've recalled something that Sir Moor said. He discovered deep purple water lilies blooming on the southern shore. Oh. That must be where St. Trina was left to wither away. Hey. Yes, please do. Please go. Please go. I wanna. Oh, I wanna do his quest line. I wanna see what happens. I'm heading south to the shore. Sir Moor mm. mentioned. Have fun. So now, if we teleport south, maybe we'll see him there? Ah. Uh, the Blade of Nicola. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Rub it in his face. I want him to be able to see her too. Wait, why is it so misty? Wait, what? Oh, right, we're in it. We're in the fissure now. Okay. Um. Oh, I thought that was going to be him. Uh... Okay, so he's disappeared from here. Maybe a... Maybe he's right here? Where did he go? I want to see what he says when he gets there. 
Unless he's there already. In which case, I guess we could just... Maybe he's there already. Uh... Actually, do any of you guys know where he goes after that? I would really like to talk to him. I want to see what happens. Maybe... Hmm. Oops. Didn't mean to put that down. Maybe we teleport here, see if he's there, and if not, we can backstep. Should be there already? Okay. Sweet. Alright. Oh, right. Um. Okay, cool. Wrong one, but it works out. There we go. Oh! Well, he's dead. That's okay. You know what? He died doing what he wanted, I guess. Then you too must have played the fool to send Trina's garden of deepest purple. It's a really pretty garden. Drifting off in the sea of her poison. Soon. Mm. Oh, I almost forgot. You mustn't follow my example. Centrina's poison would plunge you into an eternal slumber. Yeah, it about that. Me. And only me. Ooh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, oh, hey, okay. Oh, that's nice that we can pass no, on the words. Oh. Not you. Only I can doze off in the sea of Citrina. Why would you hear her voice when I cannot? If you should utter these cruel untruths to me again, I, I won't be held responsible for my actions. I don't really want to fight him. Drink nectar and talk to him and then repeat twice. Do I have to do that or do I just uh, talk to him, like just pass on the words again? Why is it misty? My brain fall over. Dude, I love that song Lost. Yeah. Please. Enough. I cannot believe your cheek. Sorry, I'm sir. Pass on words in the nectar. I will never, I will never forget you. Okay. Uh, okay. She's so pretty. And I love this area. This is a really pretty cave. I love the flowers. I'm just a big f sucker for flowers. Ugh. <laughs> I'll never forgive Sky for being so darn cool. What do you mean? <laughs> Thank you. I don't know about that though. I don't know about that. I was just mad at being told he's maidenless. Okay, so these are the words we've already heard. Also, this music is gorgeous. All right, time to talk to the boy again if he's still alive. I see. Ah. Oh! Jeez! Uh. Hi there. Sir, weren't you just EP a second ago? I... How are you finding the strength to move? Okay, Mr. Poisoner. I'm so sorry! I'm sorry! I, I talked to your waifu! Listen! 
You can't control who she talks to, buddy. That's, that's, that's not a, that's, that's manipulative. She could have friends other than you, okay? Oh, I do not want to be poisoned. Please do not. Wee, butterflies! Sir, I'm sorry. She has other friends. St. Trina's smile. What is that? Oh. Dude, I thought he was behind the fog gate, but nope. Oh. You. I was no good to anyone. Beginning to end. No, you were great. Weak as a kitten. And thick as two planks. You were fine. I suppose dying in disgrace is fitting. You're fine. Oh. Please. Sir, you were fine. You were fine. You, spoke you did good. Back then. What did Satrina tell you? You are a wretched, wretched soul. Mm. A nightmare could plague me. Such a thing could possibly be. Satrina, look at this bloody hateful, my everlasting slumber. I, ah, uh, even though he's being a bit of a jerk, I, I do feel bad for him. Also, hi Slipknot, hi Horizon, it's good to see you both, Satrina, welcome in. Let me hear your voice in my everlasting slumber. Satrina. You know what? I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna do it again. Average parasocial. <laughs> uh, bro, she's just not into you like that. <laughs> ah, I didn't like me talking to her. Gosh, bro, you gotta let your lady have friends. You can't just tell her who she can and can't talk to, you know? That's weird. Quest done for now. For now? Oh, okay, okay. Uh. Alright, we've already heard her say this. So I'm gonna skip, see if he says anything, and... Yeah, that'll be... It for this area, I guess. Uh, you got a PlayStation portal today? Hey, that's awesome, Cronius! How do you like it? Bro just, yeah, he big sleepy. Big sleepy. Okay. Well, I think we gotta end here today. I've got some places to be tonight. But, this was fun. I'm glad we were able to kill the knight, even though we didn't get the, uh, you know. Even though we didn't get the scatter tree fragments. Skadooshy douche fragments. We got one of them. So... I guess we'll just have to be happy with one, and then if we find another one next time, that'll be good. Uh, but thank you guys so much for stopping by today! Uh, we're gonna be back on Thursday uh, with more Elden Ring, and then on Friday we have a very, very special Skyrim challenge run that we're doing. So, I hope you guys, I hope you guys will be there for it. Hopefully Skyrim doesn't break, because it loves doing that to me, but it's gonna be a lot of fun. So fun! Yeah, I'm so sorry. Yeah, we're ending. I got a, I got a meeting I gotta go to, so I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be out. But it's good to see you. Welcome in. Welcome, welcome! We beat the putrid night. No Wednesday. Not this week, I'm sorry. But yeah, don't worry! We're gonna be playing Skyrim on Friday. We're gonna be doing a challenge where all the doors are gonna be randomized. It's gonna be great. Have I had a Wednesday stream in a while? Yeah, we usually don't stream on Wednesdays, usually just because Wednesdays are my busy days. Uh, I've been kind of thinking about going to five days a week, though. I think it'd be kind of fun. But we will see. Mm -hmm. Knight, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Glad you could be here since Choya raided. Hey, Stubborn, it's good having you. Thank you so much for stopping or for sticking around. I hope you had a good time. Choya's a great friend. 
Congratulations, have fun at the meeting. Thanks, self fan. Thank you, thank you. I will. It'll be a fun time. Lots of good stuff. Let's see. Do we have anyone to raid out to today? We do. We have a few people to raid out to. Oh my gosh. Ooh. Actually, do you guys want to go out to Sunny? It looks like Sunny is playing Pokemon. We were just talking about Pokemon earlier. So let's go say hi to Sunny. She is lovely. We love Sunny. Uh, she is the sun to my moon. She is lovely, lovely. <laughs> All right. Tramp. Very rude. Five days, damn. Mods better get paid. <laughs> oh, man. I'm sorry. We'll see. We'll see, though. We'll see. We'll see. I would like to do that. I think it'd be a lot of fun. But yeah. All righty. Thank you guys so much for hanging out. I hope you guys have a great day. You've seen some of the, thing, the Skyrim crowd control stuff? Yeah, Skyrim does have crowd control. That's not what we're going to be doing on, on Friday. We're going to be doing a door randomizer, but it's still going to be a lot of fun. We might do crowd control at some point, but yeah, Friday is uh, Friday is randomized door challenge. I'm going to come up with a bit more like rules and stuff for it. Uh, but yeah, it'll be a lot of fun. All right, well, have a great night, you guys. Thank you so much for hanging out. We'll be back on Thursday. And until then, I hope you guys have a great evening. I'll see you guys later. Good night, good night. <laughs> good night.